Sweden. Oh, Sweden, right. Damn, you must be jet lag now. Because I'm, I'm still recovering from my jet lag. It's not 100%. I am. Good. I am. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. I am. I'm, I'm still, I wake up at like 3 in the morning. I've, I'm tired at 5, 6 in the evening. I uh, I start, I took some NyQuil last night, so yeah. make sure I knock my ass out. Cause so now, like, then you, now you got to go to China tomorrow, a day after tomorrow. Shit. I'm going to Arizona tonight. So. Yeah, well, that's a short trip, though. You still up in that plane. I don't I know, care. I know. <laughs> I know. Milos. Hey. Representing Power Slap. <laughs> Milos had me jealous all fucking Saturday watching them damn fights. Man, it was such an experience. Jesus Christ. You can actually... It was an experience I'm... for me to watch you sit there. It's <laughs> unbelievable. I'm like, look Man. at this fool sitting right up front. I was like, I hope somebody just, just hit somebody and just some blood right in his face. I, I, I would have stayed it. I wouldn't watch the t-shirt, man. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I would probably frame it. Yeah, but yeah. it's so awesome, though. It's so awesome, man. You know? Unbelievable, it's... man. Yeah, yeah. But you know what? Is it really the best seat in the house? I, that was the best seat in the house. I mean, the I know, was but right... I, I figured you still look through the through the fence. Yeah, yeah. And you yeah, still yeah. have those. You still have those center poles, and you, you still because I I watch you. Yeah, I, I was you know, a few times. Yeah, you have to. You have to look. I watch you. Yeah, I watch you. Say, but, but then moving. I have a screen up, in moving. front of me. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. You have a screen in front of, you, and then you can put the, uh, you know, the the, the headphones so you can hear the commentary. Headphones. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Like you said, sometimes you like to hear the hum commentary. Yeah, it makes a difference. Oh, you know, yeah. Because oh, this yeah. thing and Premier, the, I mean, they see everything that. Us, maybe we don't really understand, right? Like the next move, and uh, you know what they can do. Chris, it just looked like you were sleeping. You're looking at your no, phone, no, no, no. I was reading something. Oh, okay, it looked like, it was like oh, <laughs> he's, he's dozing that? off. He's going, he's I'm all right, man. <laughs> he said, my, my brother gone. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, how was uh, Chris? How was um, how was okay? Our guest is just calling me. Hold on, how was uh, Sweden? Yeah. Cold is all out. Hello? Cold is all get out, that's for sure. Oh. And. <laughs> Wait, it's, 11, that, it's, it's 10. 10 for you, 11 for me. 11, <clears throat> it's, it says 11 a.m. Uh, Arizona time, which is now. Pacific is us. Just click on the link. I'll click on the link. All right, cool. Bye, bye. <laughs> All right, go ahead, Chris. I'm sorry. Yeah, it was just, it was very, very, very another level cold for me, but. Oh, was it, was it, was it freezing? It was snowing. It was snowing yeah. each day. Yeah. And just to get to the gym, they had a gym just across the street, and like, just to get across the street was a task. I can't imagine that, I mean, I got I to gotta take my hat off to, to the people who live there. And you know, go to the gym. You got to switch shoes in the gym because you'll be tracking water right. throughout the gym. So you got to switch shoes. But you know what? That's pretty normal in Europe. When you go to the gym, you change your clothes, you change your shoes before you get on the gym floor. Not only in Sweden, that's normal. Pretty normal. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, because I was wondering, like, because then you'll see people with just uh, no shoes on at all, and like, okay, I used to wonder. Why? But they now only I have one what? pair, so they can't switch. <laughs> yeah, they just take on the side. Melvin, do me a favor. Turn your phone sideways. What? Uh, Melvin, do me a favor. Smile a little bit. You look like a goddamn serial killer. <laughs> <laughs> says, says who? Says, says he who looks like Frankenstein. <laughs> hey, says he. Man, man. Frankenstein never smiled. What are you talking about, <laughs> man? <laughs> <laughs> well, let me go ahead and, you got me going sideways now i gotta fix no 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 you're good now you're good now Not sideways <laughs> no but see now it's looking crazy because now i don't want no you still. look normal on our screen so don't worry you're good you're good sound like john brown just just make sure your face is in the picture you don't want to stay straight hold on that's good if it, if, it, if yeah that's that's all. everyone right. stay like them it won't Okay. Which means, which tells me again that you're not prepared. Not prepared. You just ain't got the expensive shit like y'all bought us on here. Hey, $14 <laughs> in Amazon. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, motherfucker. Huh, man? I ain't got yeah. the 
like I said, it's for ballers. I, I, I got a ten dollar budget. She was cheap ass, cheap ass gap rag I got on my head. See this cheap ass? This is a wrap around I cut from a stocking. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, but and unveils it. Yeah, boy. Yeah, but now I'm prepared. Now, no, don't be don't be hate Chris because your ass bald. Mm-hmm. Okay, now I'm ready. Now ah, you're ready. Yeah, you're ready. <laughs> there you are. Said, what's up, man? What's going on? Nah? What's happening? What's new with Melvin Anthony? I said everything new for me. I'm always staying busy, you know, taking on these clients right now. You know, these guys want to eat. They like that old school training. So I'm starting to put it back out there, the Mad Circle training systems that Milo's just very, very familiar with. Hey. So what, what is it called? Same what, what is it called? Mad Circle? Yeah, Mad Circle training systems. And what it is, we created a Mad Circle back in the day. And it was just like seven guys. Uh, and we, we tried to include Sean, but, you know, Sean was never around. So we just did it amongst ourselves. And I remember training so hard, Milos used to come around there, man, Milos just get on my nerve. Milos would add these strict-ass movements to go along with John Brown's crazy stuff. But, hey, I use it to this day now. I combine the two different approaches. And so the guys that's coming to me right now, they want to put on size, you know, they want to go to the next level in their training. The whole thing for us. So this is what I'm doing now. Yeah, I'm over at this uh, gym called uh, DMF, Desert uh, Metro Fitness, half the week. And then the other half the week, I go to OC Fitness and just train clients for posing and whatever they want to accomplish. Are you, you, know? are, are, you are you going out to, to Chris's old stumping grounds? Hell yeah. Right in his backyard. Yeah. 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 He's, he's, yeah. He's that a legend. Means, hell yeah. I'm right in his backyard. Hell yeah. All in your backyard. Well, I come clear. Ain't nothing you can do about it. I'll come to the yard if I need to. <laughs> come on, come on to the backyard. You'll get this too. To the yard. Oh, just like really? before. You can come yeah. get it too. Come. I, that just Great. reminds me the last time you pulled up. <laughs> hey, Kevin, I mean Kevin, uh Dennis, the last time he pulled up with this same attitude, I had to tell <laughs> <laughs> I had to tell him something about his self. <laughs> we up there at the San Pro. We're up there at the San Francisco Pro. They called me out <laughs> call somebody else out. I forgot. The only one I really remember is this guy. <laughs> so I stand up there. I'm in my stance. They call him Melvin Anthony. Melvin Anthony walks up. He I bumped you. Me. I think I bumped you. Too. I, I, I. He whispers to me, I've been waiting for this my whole life. <laughs> yeah. I, win. Wait. I win. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we went through our little compulsory stuff. And then they said, Chris, come here back in line. I went, see you, <laughs> like, see you I, later. Why do, I think I heard this story I before. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. And as true as I'll get out. He went, but he went, but he went he behind He pulled up on me like no. that. Like, he made a good wait yeah. for this. Waiting for what? It's my job. And for all you youngsters out there that are listening right now, this was the mentality that we were taught. This is the mentality we had back then. Yeah. I don't care who it is, even a teacher. If you give me action to bite you, I'm going to bite you. You know what I mean? There ain't no inhibitions of trying to be friends and let's headbutt. Let's do a must, must to learn. Let's get up here and shake hands. I'll try to take that boy's money. I'll come to the money. Yeah, it was, mm-hmm. was, was, was it the time when uh, Craig Titus, uh, Melvin, and you were top three? Hell yeah. That's the one. Yeah, that one, that beat him up. <laughs> I'm going to beat him up, too. Oh, uh, man. Was, that, that Craig, I'm crying to Chris after that. I said, man, they, they placed Craig Titus ahead of me. And Craig, uh, Chris looked at me and said, man, you know, sometimes it's like that. Sometimes it's like that in my ass. I said, how I beat him last week? And then all of a sudden he beat me because he cried to the judges and he gave him next week. No, that's not true. You know that. You know better than that. Oh, you know Shut that. You, hey, you know a lot of things can change in one week. You don't remember? Yeah, I do. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Hell yeah. Ch- changing, changing seconds. Yeah. But you don't know why you're competing. You don't know it. No, yeah. but uh, as you said it, I, I'm going to tell you if, if I didn't tell you already. That was a time, you know, Craig was calling me and say, man, it's like 50 minutes before the show, and I'm still holding water. Can I shoot this uh, uh, injectable Asics? So it's like, well, if you do it intramuscular, it's not going to work. You have to do the IV. <laughs> exactly. And, and you help him. Like Why are you helping? The seconds. You're going to get the team. You're going to get the team. Milos, you're going to get the team. Milos, See, Milos, the Milos, team. Milos helps everybody. Milos will help him. Everybody. It doesn't matter who it yeah. is. It doesn't matter if he's on the team or not. That's his, yeah, he's going to help. That's his personality. That he will just that help idiot. anybody. He sure I will. Not, not help, man. Yeah. Come on. He sure will. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can't get mad of him giving right. somebody else an, <laughs> an advice. Yeah, but back then we did. Back then, 
No, no, no. I'll tell you another story. What you mean, no? Nobody got mad for somebody giving mad. advice. Okay, let me tell you what they used to get mad at then. Well, let's talk about what they used to get mad at. <laughs> Go Back ahead. then, they used to have all the influx of all the steroids from, from Europe. They had the Italy, you know, this and that. They had um, Italian this and that. You remember that came in? So it was funny because when I was hanging out with Chris, I got my first, like, introduction to training. His style, you know, I, I have trained with me, Losh, I've trained with Chris. I was fortunate enough to be around all you guys. So this particular time, you know, Flex said, hey, man, you didn't come to the house because they see me hanging with Chris. I said, but I'm from the street. I know what, I know what the heck it is. He wanted some information. I said, so whatever it is to get the information, I'm going to give it to you, but I'm going to get some information from you. He said, okay, come on, come over, man. He said, come over. I got something for you. So Chris told me that, and he said, don't you tell that don't you tell that motherfucker what I got over here. <laughs> I said, what do you mean? I said, don't tell him what I got over here. Now, at the time, Chris had a big-ass case of steroids, <laughs> of everything. Okay? I don't care. I, I don't care. I'm going to put it on my stuff out there like <laughs> that. <laughs> I don't care. Shit, it ain't like we didn't take them. Like we didn't take them. So Chris told me, don't you take your ass over and tell him nothing I got over here. I said, okay, I won't tell him. But why would, so he, show, I, why would he show it to you, though? Cause, cause I seen him. Cause the guy came over and Chris paid him. Oh. I seen him when he came to know. <laughs> I, mean, I, was, I was at Chris' house more than more than his damn mom and daddy. I know Chris was talking about. The time. But go ahead. So he came in there. He remember that day, right? He said, Chris, told me, you're going over flex. I said, I'm going to go over flex. Chris says, okay. When you get over there, you tell me everything he got. So you okay. basically, so you basically confirming what flex and what Chris was saying at the one podcast we had together, where they said they Hell never, yeah. they never discussed what they taken. Hell no, because them two, even though they was homies. They didn't want that. They wanted Cause, that edge. Because li literally, I know I didn't believe it. I didn't. Be Milos, no, didn't be Milos didn't believe it either. It's the. Tr I promise you, it's the truth. Yeah. So I went over there that day. And Flex and Chris said, "You better call me as soon as he had black bears back there. Remember that? They had a big ass black bear. You better call me as soon as you get over there." So okay, I got you. I get over Flex house, big ass house, big old driveway, like driving over damn Steven Seagal house something. I said, "That nigga living damn man." Was that was that that seven story house that was only five stories? Hell yeah, that shit. Was big as hell. <laughs> got, got to the end of the, end of the driveway. Nigga, he opened the door with that crazy ass dog. Come on. I said, first of all, you better get that dog before I shoot it. You know what I'm get that dog. Because he had two houses like that. One was in. Uh, in I went to the one in Walnut. <laughs> I said, the one the one all by, by Brea, way out in the hills. By Orange County? <laughs> yeah. I went to that one. It's, it's two different ones, uh, Dennis. One, the other one no, was. Well, I'm, yeah. I'm, I, I, I've never been to neither one of them, but yeah, all, all I know there. is that he he's, he mentioned the seven-story mansion that was only five stories, I heard. Yeah, yeah but he not, So, so there, there, there had to be two ghost stories on top that nobody ever knew yeah, about. Yeah, he probably put, he put, put both of them motherfuckers together. <laughs> put, them, put them on top of <laughs> each other. In his mind, he just put them on top of each other. And yeah. Up and downstairs. <laughs> so I get over there, right? Yeah. So I get over there. I get in the door, and, you know, you know, Flex has a real monotone demeanor, you know. And like a preacher, he says, in, go ahead and enter. And then, hey, no smile. I said, what's up, boy? He said, yeah, enter. Come on in. So I walk in. He tries to be all modest and shit. He said, no, he was excited. I got there, right? I get over the house. <laughs> Yo, Flex is, right? I don't care. I talk, talk about his ass. He get over there. He shows me the kitchen. And you know, then the whole time, his dog is sniffing me, right? I said, this dog ain't going to bite me, right? He said, no, he ain't going to bite you. I said, come into the garage. I got to show you something. We get in the garage. He open. He had a bunch of windstorm and a whole lot of anavar. <laughs> Hell yeah. I said, I look at that shit. I said, hey, what's that? He says, That's, this is the stash Chris don't know about. I said, shit, until tonight, motherfucker, he gonna know. <laughs> he gonna know tonight. <laughs> so I get in there, he starts counting through them, and he gave me a sack. He gave me like, he gave me like 10, 10 of everything. He give me the 10 of these, and I want you to try these. I want you is to this more? Is this more than 20 years ago? Yeah, a long time. Oh, the statute of limitation expired. Thank <laughs> God. Yeah, so statute of limitation. Got damn right. So he can't do nothing. Not immunity. They can't do nothing to me. Statute of limitation is over. So you know, he'll be able to kiss my ass. Like, so, so I get over there. I don't care nothing about it. I don't care nothing about it. Like, that's still <laughs> Twenty years. It don't matter. So, so he come in there. I got him. He's talking to me about what I should do, how I should eat, and he telling me all this stuff. He kept bringing Chris up. I said, Why do you keep bringing Chris up for? I thought he's supposed to be the homie. You know, he says, Yeah, but y'all, I know Chris is doing something, and I know you know something. But I ain't no snitch. You know what I mean? I ain't, I'm from the, I'm the neighbor. I ain't going to tell on him. He says, yeah, I know, he, I know he got the, I can't remember what Chris had he wanted. I don't know what he had, but Chris had them all. Chris bought them all. Chris bought the whole load. He's, <laughs> he don't know about us getting nothing. You know, you know when homeboys came from uh, from Europe and everything in those those suitcases. The suitcases. Uh, stand at the, uh, what's that hotel in the? the Marina, uh, Marina, Pacific. Pacific. Uh, Marina, Marina Pacific. Marina Pacific. Marina <laughs> Pacific. 
very Pacific. I remember so because I this, this is what this now. this is the hotel where I stayed the first time I came to Venice. I remember that. Yeah, yeah. the right. first time. Yeah, the first time. Yeah. And, and everybody and everybody time. and everybody used to go eat there too breakfast. Everybody. Yeah. Yeah, they had the best food, best breakfast for yeah, a good yeah. deal. Mm-hmm. I just love yeah. people there, man. Right there on the beach. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, so I get back to Chris' house. He tell me, he say, "Hey, man, what, what, so what's going on, man?" I get out, I text Chris. I said, "Chris, man, he the boy got a whole lot of stuff." And he said, "What does it look like? Send me a, send me a picture of." So, but what would that? Said, what what is all that going to change, though? If you if he knows said, what he's got, I. Because you see, what it was is they they used to exchange supplements, right? But they used to exchange everything, but they kept certain things away from each other. I got Anavar and and Vince Stroll. That, yeah. that, is that what we're arguing about right now? I'm no, sure everybody arguing. knew they're taking Anavar and Vince Stroll. But anyways, listen. Yeah. We we, we we kind of went away from from what you're doing with your training. So you know, I want to talk no. about I want to talk about the natural way of making money. <laughs> mm-hmm. so that's your way of making money. It's two ways. It's like putting on muscle. That doesn't change about putting on muscle. Yeah. And that's what I think a lot of the guys that I'm running into so, are but, running into. They ask me the first thing they ask me, hey, how can I take steroids? I said, How about hey, learn how to train first? Yeah. How about that? How's your training? You how how train. is your training going though? That's what I really want to know. My my training is going really good. I train about uh four or five days a week. Because Chris is uh, back Chris it. is back training, Milos is back Milos, you tra- you're training, right? Yeah. Okay. I've been a, started. They can yeah. Tra- train all you want to. I'm in but I'm in better shape than Chris right now. I'm better Christian. I'm better Chris. Right? Why is everybody? Why is everybody I, talking about Chris when it comes to being? Yeah, Chris, 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 because Chris, because let me tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Because Chris, I've been, nobody Chris, pull up. Nobody was trying to pull up in the back of the day like that. No, I pulled up. I, I went pulled to up. I lay my sword down. And huh? you know, you come at me. Oh, you, you, laid, you, you laid it on me. I didn't lay my. Sword. Now I'm picking it back up again now. So, so I'm about, I'm about two hundred pounds right now. I'm about two hundred pounds. About eleven percent body fat. You know, I go to the gym and well, train. Chris got you by at least 65 pounds. Yeah. And he, 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 how, much, how much Chris weigh? 265. 265. You lost some weight, 265? right? 265. I don't know how much he did. Weight. He, well, he was, he, was, he, was, he was 277 a month ago. How do you take off a shirt, man? The whole thing. Hey, man, I got to take off the whole shirt. You take off a shirt like you take off a, like a female would take a shirt off. I grew up around females, so you should already know. No. Oh, wow. <laughs> you got to be at a. All right, a, all right. Let me let let let's let's see what you look like. Huh? Shit, ain't got a hair on his body, man. I'm jealous. Damn. That's it. I ain't no hairy hairy monkey. No, no, no. Okay, I'm one. That is Why do you want to see it? Huh? Why do you want to see it? You don't Ah, come on, come on, man. You're the master poser. Don't ask us for a rich pose. Hit it all, man. Yeah. Go ahead, turn around. Let me see the back. Let me get the back. Yeah, bicep. You ready? Can you see the whole thing? Look at that chair. You look like a stripper. Yeah. I got to do it here, okay? Can you see? Yeah, we can see, man. Just go ahead. Put your butt down. He still got it though. He still got it. He still got it. It's small, but he got it. What are you talking about? Yeah. Hey. Oh, you know, don't be mad, Chris, because you see that size. It's the uh, it's That's not real, man. That's a, yeah. Let me see you. Okay, okay. You're mad because you ain't got no abs. What is that? His abs off? I. <laughs> well, Chris, I'm sure Chris got abs. We just can't I'm see him. To, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. Uh, Teach you how to pose again, I think, man. <laughs> hey, he did legs also, Dennis. He didn't see it. He climbed on the chair and then he, he showed us the legs. Oh, really? He looked fabulous. Man. I want to chair again. Don't you climb up on that chair, man? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Get that thing out. The Look at him. Thing. Look at him. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, you know what that means, right? Mel- Melvin's back on the juice. I ain't back on shit. Oh, shut up. I ain't back on shit. You telling me that di- you telling me this is anything? Come on. You you telling me you're not taking anything? I take one shot of test every three weeks. Yeah. 
the two 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 um, tests away, I was six hundred, and the last <laughs> one, my physical, I was five hundred. Yeah, you, you can bump it up. I mean, I, I where'd, you, where'd you go check yours? At? You got to check. You get checking your free testosterone, or are you checking your total, or which one are you checking? They check everything. Yeah. Where where are you che- where'd you check at the hospital? You told me to get free check. What do you mean the hospital? I got no. I, I, with, 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 with my primary care physician, I got I got That's insurance. I got insurance. That's the phone now. Huh? Mm-hmm. It's my primary. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't go. I didn't go to no uh, to no uh, uh, HRT clinic. I didn't do that. Hey, I'm gonna go to my primary and have it done then. Yeah. Get the free in total. I got the, the total, but not the free. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> it's a monitor. I'm just trying to stay in shape and stay healthy. You know. Yeah. I see a lot of people are passing, and I don't. I don't like what I'm seeing. So you know. Have you ever test? Have, have you ever have, have you ever test. tested yours? Do you know what your level is, Melvin? No, I don't. I haven't tested it in a long time. I haven't tested it since I was competing. Oh really? Mm-mm. Why well, not? You don't care. You don't know. You don't. But but then again, you have no symptoms, do you? No what? You don't have no low low testosterone symptoms, do you? So I'm still hitting. It. What do you mean? I'm still knocking my own wrong down. <laughs> Hell no! I got nothing wrong with my shit. <laughs> <laughs> Well, as long as she, as long as she can get it up, this doesn't mean that your yeah. test level is good. How, how's yeah, your okay. sex drive? Yeah, how my, my, my sex drive? Man, you always been a toad. toad. Come on, man. <laughs> I still smash. So I don't he's, know. Still, he's still, he's still, hey, he's still, hey, he's still hanging out in the strip club. So you know his sex drive is high enough. So from time, yes, from time to time, I will go knock one down every once in a while. You know what I'm saying I do what I want. When, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, so, Milo, so, Milo, so, so, yours is a thousand with two fifty a week. Mine, yeah. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Have you ever have you ever not used it for a while and, and tested yeah, to see like what is the lowest? Three years. Uh, you know and what happened? What's happening for me? Uh, I, I said I don't need this shit, and three years I didn't do it, and then I realized like, who am I fooling? I mean, why? Uh, I feel a certain way on. And uh, completely different without it. Mm-hmm. So why wouldn't I take it? Uh, was I afraid? I mean, the major thing about every everybody that is not taking, they are afraid. What are you afraid of? Yeah, that's why I'm wondering why Chris is not doing it. Yeah, I told you five like times. Well, why? Tell me again. I didn't hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Forget it. <laughs> no, forget nothing. Why you don't know? I'm gonna. I'm, I plan to put it that way. I plan to okay. get back on the horse. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, don't you think that, uh, nowadays, like uh, m- men are becoming less manly and more, you know, feminine? You more know, feminine? Like, Is that I, what you're saying? A lot of it's by choice. A lot of them do want to act like a girl because they want to be a girl. They by choice. Girl. But anyway, so just boost the testosterone. I mean, shit. Yeah. You're so against it. You know, you should be a thousand, and if you drop under, you don't know, shoot more. <laughs> so, Dennis, if you're just hundred, you know, you should bump it up to 150 and then two and then two. <laughs> I'm good. From yeah, the, I'm my, good. my biggest problem is to stay consistent with the shots. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. I just That's traveled. I just traveled for six weeks. I didn't do nothing. Yeah, I can imagine. You know yeah, what I'm saying? You go to the gym at all when you're training? You used to. Huh? You used to not. You used to say you still hit the gym when you travel, though. Like you. you no, you I, I mean, I went to the gym yeah, when I was in Germany gym. in the gym. But when I once I went to Dubai or to Italy or, or, or to Orlando, I wasn't not one time did I train. Mm. Well, now let me take it back. Orlando, I trained once. Okay. Yeah, once. But this Chris, is not. Chris, what this about is you? Not you guys are still training when you travel? Yeah, I was training. Yeah. Okay. Chris is on a mission. Chris, uh, Chris, uh, we have uh, we have a date set in June where we all got to do what you did today. Oh shit! Oh, is that what we doing? Yeah. <laughs> so oh, it's, the, 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 it's okay. just a motivation kick for Chris because Chris did let himself go just a little bit, mm-hmm. and he's on his way I lay, back. I, lay my, I call it laying my sword down. Yeah. Is that what, what you said? So I got a motivation to pick it up. <laughs> so, do, so do you need some motivation to pick it up? Like you said, you're gonna help me master my posing. Yeah. So you, 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 we go battle like we used to. We go, we go head up like we used to. I always say, I always say this. <laughs> I, you know, okay. Guys. I'm like, don't buy better than yours. So that jab <laughs> shot. And. <laughs> yes. Or you might give me on ab because you naturally born with that, but you can't fuck with me on the back, period. <laughs> so I don't care nothing about that. You can't help me do nothing on that shot. I will help with you with the back, don't buy something. Tell that lie. Get on here and lie and say I didn't. What, you didn't want me to give you a date? 
You want me to give you a date in your no. living room? How many times I just sent a picture to you in my living room. Mm -hmm. I just sent a picture you in my living room in Orange County, yes, right did. there off of uh, what you call it. And I'm I'm working with you on some shit. Yes, yes, and you I can, did. I can point out the shit that you took from my routine and using your yes, own. Yes, you, yes, you can. I can point it out. You know I can. Yes, you, yes, you can. We don't I, need I, to I go there. Agree. I know we you don't have clients to and shit. I don't want to, I want your clients to come knocking on my door. Man, Michael, your clients can go knock on your door all they want to. They, I don't have to see. That's me. I don't inhibit. I don't inhibit in, 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 in capacity you know anybody I, from getting what they want. And you want to go with Chris? Mistake. You gonna get the real deal? Spread your leg apart because everybody can't and do never, that. But you got niggas doing. Never make it. a mistake. Palm Springs is my hometown. Guess what? Never ever so, ever. So this ever, is what I need you to do. This I is what am I need the Hall of Famer. I need you I to make sure that you say Chris Cormier approves Melvin Anthony to be in my neighborhood because I'm already off over there. And they love me over there. And they love yeah, Chris sure. Cormier. You're the king. Yeah, you're the king. I guess am. What? I am. That's a, yeah, but uh, yeah, that's okay. Royalty is the same the, kind of love. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't give you the, the okay yet. So you need to call me and ask me about that. Uh, just like a <laughs> man, you, you remind me of one of my aunties. You got, you got my number. number. You got my number. And I call you all the time on Snapchat. Same with Milos. I need to get up in Milos's face in, in, in Vegas so he can talk more <laughs> shit because it don't matter. It's in the home over there. Yeah, man, I home, man. Are you in Palm Springs? Really? Yeah, I've been driving down there. I've been driving down there yeah, three times yeah. a week. Three yeah, times a week I drive down there. I would go down there more, but I just... Them little youngsters are hungry down there. Those guys are hungry. Those guys are... The women and men, those guys, they they want it. It's they a lot of uh, community of fitness and training down there now. Oh, and absolutely. I had to be out like we weren't enough. How far away yeah. are you, Chris, when you're in San Diego? How far is that? Well, I was in something. Oh, it's not that bad. Well, I don't mind going down there. It's just I haven't been super busy lately, boy. Yeah. That's okay. Don't worry about it. I got it. I got you. <laughs> I'll hold it up till you get back. Yeah. I sure will. Yeah, I got a lot of love for that town because that's where I did my first couple of shows in my life. Mm -hmm. And, you know, being born and raised there. And see how you try to emphasize that born. So you and should. Raised. So you should. And so you should. So you should give your blessing to Melvin going down there and, and, and yeah, making it happen. Call me though. Well, call me. And let me know what's up. I didn't. Well, see, you know, it just started happening yeah, like yeah. a couple weeks ago. Melvin didn't so check ahead. in. I'm a formally. I'm formally asking you now. Just give me the blessing. Melvin, stop Melvin didn't check <laughs> in. <laughs> no, you sound like I haven't checked it on. I haven't checked it on. <laughs> I'm coming down to Vegas to check in. You're too. Check I need in. To get I need to get a hold of couple. I need to get a hold of a couple of his clients. I need to help your boy. I need to help your boy. Go ahead, Milos. You seen that picture, uh, you, me, uh, Troy, and Melvin? I posted on the, on the Instagram. I got it from... I, I, think that's, I think that's shot from the Olympia. I have no idea where it's from. No, it's not from I the Olympia. If it was the Olympia, I wouldn't be standing there fat. Come on now. I said, who yeah. was standing there fat? That's me. Me. You, didn't you, didn't, you didn't compete that year, so I don't know. Well, what do you mean you didn't compete that year? That picture was in my in my in I my time I when I, I was competing. I competed every year from 2000 to 2010. Well, I don't know then. That's a, I don't know. Well, that's, oh, that's a good, it's you, a good you shot, did though. Your 11 Olympias? Yes. Yeah. You're 11, I did. Who did 11? Me. What's five, wrong with you guys? You all six, forgot. Seven. You all must eight. have forgot. Nine. I did. I did seven. I didn't you do no qualified eleven. every year, huh? Yeah. I qualified I I every year, Chris. Seven. Yes. Yeah, Chris. Uh, and I, and my, yes, my, my the, the, the best qualification I ever got was beating your ass. Yes, a couple of times. Look, you let me bring that up one more time. You, you, since you, you, you started, it, since you started it. And Chris didn't like that shit. <laughs> <laughs> you see? I always, I, Melvin, wait, I always. I never wait, wait, wait. I'm talking to the audience. I ain't even talking to y'all right now. I'm talking to the audience. <laughs> you see how they talk to me? You see how they talk to me? I'm like, the, I like the that. Audience audience. No, it. you started it by asking me. You, you, you competed. You qualified every year? No, I got. I, I never got a special invite. I never got a special invite. Y'all see how they see how they be doing me on here? We, we all earned it. We all earned it. So we got, hey, we got a lot of fans. Hey, wait. We got a lot of fans that be hitting me up. We're like, man, they, they love the show. And they they, they love what we're doing on here. They think we hella funny. And uh just want to give a shout out to the fans that's keeping uh right. keeping us on keep, keep on every week. All we gotta get a shot. Every at. week, they hear every week waiting for this. Mm. Yeah, waiting for me to talk something tell, tell another story. So that's what they hey, want to know. Talk to you, Dennis, man. They complain I talk too much, so I'm yeah. gonna make it deserve. Who complains? You don't talk too much. Nobody complains. Nobody complains. Like, yeah, shut the no, no, no. They're complaining about you talking too much on other podcasts. 
<laughs> That's the complaint that I get. I said, listen, I said, I get the complaint. I said, why is Milo's always telling the stories already on three podcasts before he tells it on yours? <laughs> <laughs> I don't pay attention to the story. The story. I'm, 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 we repeat the everything. Did you ever beat Chris? Of course. Um, Chris, I don't know. No, he didn't. I don't didn't. think so. I, I, I he think he did. Chris would know. Chris would know. Ask Chris. He would know. Chris would know. Chris at the end. At the end. Chris last. Chris at the end. At the end. Chris at the end. After I'm on. Wait. Yeah, but <laughs> did nobody tell you to bring your ass up there? <laughs> did, no, did nobody tell your ass you 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 seen national? I'm trying to keep my I'm trying to keep my fucking living going, man. What you yeah, 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 keep your living all you want to. You, you know what happens? Trying to keep your contract type of show. Hell yeah, you, you know you know what happens to them lion? The lion that get hurt, you get got that third leg, got three legs instead of four. Them lions, he said, you got to go on by yourself. You know what they tell you to show up that day? You know what the time was. And I felt bad taking it, but I took that shit. I was like, shit, I'm going to take that money. But I love yeah. you, Chris, like a mother. I, I had no you. choices. There was really the contract. Read yeah, the contract. I love you. We had to do it. No, yeah, I was, you had to compete. No, I, was, I was with a muscle tech at the time, but I was trying to keep I was trying to keep that AGs coming in every month. Shit. I was like, I got to do yeah, it. I yeah, <laughs> yeah you, that, that, that last time you walked around, man, that was a hard, swallow, a hard pill to swallow for everybody. Yeah, man. man. That, Hey, and hard pill. Everybody was looking at Chris like we didn't even want to go upstairs. They said, "No, man, just give him some money, whatever." We're like, nah, man. That Chris, he came. He was talking to everybody, and and Chris is so uh, uh, heartfelt when he talks, and he knows something going on. He don't, he don't really cry, or he don't, he don't really, you know, he, you just tell he was down. He's on his way out. I guess I took it. Same when I said, "We, I took a flex." Did nobody tell him to get on stage? You get on there, I'm gonna eat you up. Yeah, come on up here. Yeah, yeah, but well, I'm gonna get that money though. Edelman, yeah. Yep, I took it. And Milo said, oh, I helped you. Flex, he made a big change. I don't give a damn what kind of change. He put it in a metamorphosis. I don't give a yeah, damn. You get up here, you, man, I'm a tech. If you would see him three weeks before that, you would, you would bet your life he cannot step on stage. I mean, mm -hmm. I, I, right now, you looked way better than he was three weeks out of the, the Iron Man. Mm -hmm. Right now? Bad, but you know what I mean? Yeah, right he looked bad. <laughs> There's a lot, a lot of things that happens around people that just happen at the end. I beat him, and then they say, "Oh, what's well, going to feel like you'll be running?" And this and that. I was like, "Man, sure." Yeah, but it's it's and different. It, it, if it, it's different, if, I mean, I'm it's different saying. beating people after past their prime. You know, I mean, it's no, like no, boxers. It's just, it's like once you're on your way out, you know, you're going to get beat by like, people uh, that are just Gaspari younger. Gaspari came to the yeah. the night of champions. I don't really mm -hmm. consider myself beating Gaspari. You know, yeah. I had his like on his, that's his last leg. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Only reason why I, I took I took that win over Flex is because he thought he was gonna beat me. And he was standing backstage, yeah. so he gonna beat me. He was like, okay, yeah, you gonna beat little, me. Little guy hey, tell him. Him. He was he was ahead of you of the prejudging. You beat him in the posing round. I well, guess what? That being posing work then, don't it? That maybe he should have got with me. He should have practiced. Did nobody tell him to get on stage like that? Mm -hmm. But anyway, hey, listen. Yesterday I got a, a phone call from uh, Andrea Presti from Italy, right? And he was asking me uh, to go. Uh, on podcast with him and talk about Ronnie being natural back in uh, 91, 92, 93, 94, then because nobody believes it. So he was. Like, he, he, was. he was. He was. Yeah. He was for sure. The thing is, but, he did the, he, but listen, he did the, the he did the universe in 91 and he passed the test. I didn't even go to all the, the test. Didn't go to the test. I said, I'm not going to go. Ronnie plays ahead of me. I know he's natural. So why would he waste my time? Going even to get a uh, get tested. Hmm. Yeah, but but that year, if you remember, he was like 14th at the USA, 14th. Mm -hmm. And then he goes to the, uh, the national the wins. Yeah. And so he, he actually made Olympia twice, drug free, ninety two mm -hmm. and ninety four. Yeah, you no, know, you know who else did that? Uh, same like Darren. Darren Charles was natural for a long time before he started taking it. Sean Gillion. Sean Gillion, too. That yeah, Jean Paul Gillion. Yeah. This guy wouldn't take the aspirin when he had a headache. Mm -mm. I mean, yeah, he's, 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 he's crazy doing. shape. Yeah. He's insane. Those guys back then, they lift weights, though. They train. That's why you, a lot Twice of people get day, six days a week. Yeah, they train. You know, another one that trained hard. It was such a nice guy. He would, they would yeah. send the guy around on, uh, that would come to our rooms when we were on the tour. And he would buy it for a guy, for a friend back home and just bring it home to another friend. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, so you would think who, uh, you know, the training, the training regiments, Chris, I wanted to touch on that. They said how the people training now is different than how we train when we were coming through. Yes or no? Well, we didn't have phones to, to keep our attention. We get a lot of people on the phones and shit. I seen your post on Instagram yesterday. 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> Not necessarily in post. Is it because there, there's a lot of training difference, differences I see, the way they train now. Yes, they have a lot of more modern equipment and stuff like that, but I think it's the approach in itself. It's not the same. You know, they're not just, they're not leaving the gym like we used to, like hoping that you wouldn't bring your ass back. <laughs> you know what I mean? They don't, they don't do that no more. I remember, you know, coming in and, and I remember a time in, uh, me and Chris were doing legs one day and, and Charles, Charles was trying to pitch us against each other that day, remember? And we were doing those front, uh, front that sled that that hack squat reverse hack squat and you were doing eight plates nine plates chris doing eight plate nine when i was trying to keep up with you rep for rep and i was dying i said but i was trying to kill him i was trying to make chris quit shit and i went to that bucket <laughs> when i went to that bucket i went and hit and threw up he came outside and said you know you still got walking lunges after this you remember that <laughs> said, if you don't finish you gotta start the whole workout over i was like man fuck you he said man you better finish you better finish i was doing that walking lunges throwing up at the same time i said i never forget that workout I said, guys like that they ain't doing that nowadays they're not, they're not leaving in the gym. They're not going there and see, see Milos laid out. Then they see, I ain't even seeing Milos laid out in his own gym. And Milos should lay himself out. I come in, what's wrong with you? Man, I just finished his legs, man. What? If you push yourself to heat, push yourself out. So then it's after that, man. Yeah. Every, Every time little, after leg workout, I would have to pass out for like 30 minutes, raise yeah. and don't talk to me, don't say hello, don't do nothing. Uh, yeah. Come back to the senses, yeah. But uh, as you say, Melvin, nowadays there is so much more machines Hardly any gym has real freeway room. I mean, you have a, I know, but you can go all out on machines. You can still go all out. Yeah, yeah you can go all out, but it's, it's just different. It's just different. It's not like the percentage of a machines to free weight hmm. is, uh, you know, going to, to machines. Yeah, yeah. It's different. I mean, even your gym back in the day, Dennis, you come on, man. As I showed up for your gym, I think the same thing. I'm going to kill Dennis. You know, there's only a few people that, can, that they really can say they took me out. Chris, one of them. <laughs> Dennis, Ronnie Coleman, Branch Warren. That's it. Ain't nobody else took me out nowhere. I said, I come in the gym, walked into Genesis gym. I looked around. First of all, it was hot as hot as hell. Yeah, but said, what, hot that... as hell. <laughs> walked in the gym. He had free weights but to the left. Yeah, yeah, the one in Thailand. Head, in Thailand. So I'm, I'm going. I say, because it's, it's funny. He going. He going to have me come up there. So I'm, I'll say, today we got leg. We got back and leg. Well, come on with it. Come on with it, then. I said, oh, come on with it, then. Let's go in the gym. I'm thinking, you know, this is going to punk out. So I'm going to kill him in here. I went in that gym. The air strike one. The heat strike two. And he got all these windows open, no air conditioning. <laughs> like I try to kill Dennis, no mama's way. Yeah, Dennis hey, kicked my ass. Kid kicked my ass, and then turned around, did some squats. I said that three or four days later, we going and doing squats. And I, I didn't know how did how strong Dennis was. I, said, I know I'm strong. I, said, I can squat. I can no skip six, seven play, no problem. Dennis starts squatting, and I'm looking over there, just looking over there in the corner. He put six plates on. Then he put seven plates on. I need you to spot. See a spot who? <laughs> no squat suit. That fool put that belt on and went up on them seven plates for reps. I went, yo set. I said, you better take some of them goddamn plates off for you. You think I'm, I'm gonna get up under that? <laughs> Come on, man. I thought you were strong. <laughs> no, not today. I know when to say when. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, me tapping out. 100 degrees, 90 percent humidity. Oh my God. See, this was a beast too. Yeah. Hey, beast. This. There was a guy in that uh, Pattaya City Universe gym uh, that uh, uh, always wore the same same tank top every single day. Stuck. Oh, Tim? Yeah, Dennis, you, 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 you're the one. about Tim. Who? Who? The white dude? You're talking about the white guy, right? Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's what I know you talk about. I don't know what you mean. Now. What, do you, what, what are you talking about? There was about? a guy that you were saying clothes all the time. Yeah, he was there every day for hours. We could never get, get to the gym that he's not there. And he stunk so bad because uh, oh. he had a one tank top. Yeah, yeah. funky Do you lessons, remember? What I, call I remember the guy, but I wouldn't remember his name or anything. Yeah, yeah. The, I think yeah. huh? we, we, all the gyms had a character. We we had a guy named Five Jacket Mac, uh, Mike. Five Jacket Mike used to come in the gym. Look, you got you got five jackets on it all the time. You got like you got at least three under that jacket. Trying to get that size. <laughs> Yeah, to get the size. <laughs> you know? Yeah, there was a hey, there was a lot of them. There was a lot of them at the at the expo in Dubai. <laughs> the Dubai Expo had a lot of them with the big hoodies. I mean, it's hot as hell. I mean, what you wearing a hoodie for? And then you hey, can tell he's got a couple of now. shirts underneath, and he's already sweating all through the shirts and through the hoodie. <laughs> that can't be no worse. Dennis, than Dennis, <laughs> Dennis, we ha- we have a guy that I uh, met out there in Sweden. I sent it to the group text right now, Milos and Dennis. You got to check it out. This guy, his name is Milos also. No way. And he's from your hometown. 
He's from your no, town. No way. And he imitating your ass. <laughs> His name is Milos. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. That guy's a real Milos yeah. right here. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Is that, you remember when the fanny packs oh, came out, D? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, so like he from guy. so he, he from was going, he was going like this. So he's <laughs> Serbian. He's Serbian too. <laughs> but hey, listen, uh, you guys were all in the, in my Colosseum gym. Madden, Madden, you probably remember there was a guy, Mister Blueberry, and uh, the girls called him Blueberry and say, "Who? Where the fuck? Here's Mister Blueberry." And it was an old guy, actually, sixty years old. I, I'm sixty, so it's not old. But he was sixty, right? He would come, change the clothes, and put those stretch pants with no underwear. Uh -huh. and, uh, exactly what I was going to tell you. That's what I was going to tell yes, you. Yeah. We're so basically, I had to go to, yeah, as a gym owner, as a, you know, I have to go to the, it's like, excuse me, sir, man, but <laughs> that, that doesn't look appropriate. <laughs> you know? Let me tell you, Dennis, this guy, you remember, this like, Dennis remember this hold guy. On, hold on, hold on, Melvin, Melvin, we can't talk together. Let me let's finish. Okay. Right? Yeah, but there, there was a guy, really, and he was he wasn't showing off or anything he just that's that's the stretch pants that he got and he puts them on you could see everything which is nothing right <laughs> it's like don't do that so that imagine Milan Mod, jackie and all they will call him mr blueberry i say why well, can you call him mr blueberry i don't pay attention <laughs> <laughs> i'll tell you why they call him mr blueberry so this dude used to come to the gym and Billy used to be pissed as so he come in he just talk to the girls but when he was standing there he had a fanny pack and we used to have the long spandex but we all want to you know hide our our magic you know so he put a fanny pack here no, this guy used to remember his funny pack here, all balls, right? <laughs> and he would pull them all the way up here. They put them all the way up, and he'd be in there talking to the girl. Then he always be standing there, <laughs> and we just look at that guy. God, it, look at that guy. I'm so trying to. I look at that guy. He said all balls. So yeah, after no you, all balls. So Meadows, after you told him, did he did he did he, did he change? Yeah, did he I, I, put some... I felt bad for him, you know, because he's a, he's a gentleman actually. He didn't real he didn't realize, you know. No, come on now. <laughs> yeah, he know. He knew he be playing Milo. He knew what he was doing. He knew but, John Brown. But you know, the same, same thing. guy because this guy was called Blueberry for a reason. He didn't mm -hmm. throw balls, you know. Shit, it was like nothing. Yeah, yeah, you know? nah, nothing. It's all. It's, it's all. It's all he can see. It's just, 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 just the blueberry. Okay. That's it. That was this. Yes, yeah, yes, 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 yeah, yeah. No, just this, this, just this, and balls. That's it. Ma know, like, Ma yeah. let's, let's change the subject. <laughs> Get away from balls, Milos. You see that new guy? That you see that new guy that Chris is working with? Uh, the guy with the the, with the, the, the the tire neck, yeah, yeah. The guy with the big neck, mm. a lot of muscle on that guy. Just a big neck, man. It's, it's yeah, yeah. I mean, he's got a big neck, but everything else he's got is fucking he's huge. Said, yeah, he, he's he's got some gigantic muscles. I mean, it's gonna have to, you know, bring that back up to match them leg. But boy, that boy got a lot of muscle. That's so cool. Whew. I want to see him in person. I really like seeing him in person. Story. Yeah, it's it's a it's a different it's a different story in person. I just yeah. saw I just saw uh, Chris. Did you just post him walking on the treadmill? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't even look like the calves. It's not. It, they they know, look half the size in the fucking video. Half the size. No, I know, I know. I gotta see. I gotta see him. I know. I know he's got a lot of muscle. I remember it seeing. It didn't come out like it should, but I yeah. just posted it anyway. Yeah, I remember seeing a, a, a clip of him on tic, TikTok or something. And I thought it was fake at first. I thought it was, I thought actually it was a morph, like a morph video. Like somebody did something and blew the, blew the screen up. Yeah. But after I kept looking at him, I was like, man, that dude, that dude big as hell he ever got in shape. And he did. Now I'm looking at him now, I'm like, oh my goodness. What, what, if, what if, I know he taped his neck before, but I wonder what that actually tapes in like. That's huge. You better hit that boy with a tire iron. Yeah, but anyway, yeah. I touched that subject before. I was waiting for Steve Weinberger. You see, next week, no, I, 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 I sent him a message, but I didn't get any reply yet. Yeah. I mean, one of those things, and I want to educate myself how, how they, do they look when they're just standing there and just assess the physique before they start mm -hmm. hitting the Because uh, that's the moment when, when you see that's them. That's the area. Yeah, see, he's pretty flexible too. Yeah, but guy. the thing is, though, he didn't. You know, I mean, not having much time to even get into all the specifics on the do's and don'ts. We we didn't get to that area yet, you know. So all right, let's talk about something else, though. Is he, Chris? Is he doing the Arnold? They want him in the Arnold. 
I know they want him. I'm not sure yet. I'm what do you sure mean? What, what's the holdup, though? Well, yeah, what a hold up. I thought he got to have the visa because he's from Colombia. Okay, but if, he, if he's committing to the Arnold, they will help him with the visa. Yeah, they'll help him. All yeah, he got to give trying. him is a verbal yes. They're trying. They're trying. Right. So is that uh, is that so? It's possible that he's going to enter. Possible, yeah. Good, good. Because I think so he needs. Uh, Chris, are you training his guy? So, so, so let me let me ask you this: Would they would they help my guy from uh, Iran? Behrouz? It's different with Iranian passports than than with regular um, so Dominic, they, they Dominican, Colombian, Colombian they South American. Them. South America is much easier. Yeah, yeah easier. South America more lenient. Yeah. I'm gonna actually shut. Because of the government. Yeah, but right. listen, but I, I can talk to I can talk to Brian and see if there's anything. Can you? But at the end of the day, with the Iranian passports, all they do is they're going to put a letter in of recommendation that they want to bring him here. Yeah, recommendation. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But for Iranian, that don't mean nothing. Mm. I mean, think, think about this one. Uh, administrative processing is, you know, what what he's waiting for. And he applied for 2022 Olympia, like mm -hmm. a month before. And he's still... It wasn't processed. Yeah, so his case but is still ongoing. In the meantime, what? So his oh, case is still cool. ongoing. And now you can't, yeah. if you try to jump in there now, you're just going to hold it up even more. Just let it go, let it run. And sooner or later, he's going to get his visa, I guess. Yeah, I don't, yeah, Milos, I, I don't know what to tell you. I have no idea. Seems like that just it depends on who is the is the, the, the defining factor. Who who's the yes man? Like who who makes I mean, the decision? I mean, if on, Arnold was still the governor, if, if Arnold was still the governor, maybe he would have some pull. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, this is uh, yeah, reach out to him. What Iranian passports is different now. I mean, it's easier to get a pass, you know, to get a visa for 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 South Americans or for anybody anywhere in the world. Iran, Iran, yeah. it's just I don't know but why. Yeah. I don't know why they make it so hard for these guys. And it's not even the fucking. Yeah. It's not even the citizen of Iran. It's the fucking government that's the problem. You know. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I well, wish I wish this we, Ali. I, I wish this uh, Be 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 Beirut. Is his name Beirut? Beirut. Beirut. If man, that dude needs to be on any stage here in the U.S. Yeah, yeah. For real. He's shredded, huh? That dude. Shredded. He's not only he's shredded. He's big balance. too. That's a big dude, man. Mm. That's a big dude. Absolutely beautiful physique. You you would love him, Melvin. Yeah, I think right. I probably would. If you say. And so, I'm sure. And I'm sure there's agree. so many more in Iran that we don't even yeah, know yeah. of. I think there's a lot of body yeah. we've never seen over there. Mm. Hey, you know what? They have access. One thing I keep noticing is a lot of Iranian bodybuilders come up and say, hey, how are you? I'm from Iran. Next thing out of your mouth, how did you pump? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you pump? <laughs> okay, man. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. yeah. How I know where he lives. I know where he's from. I get he's it. got a good physique. There's a lot of guys out there like him that got great physiques. That's coming from over there. Yeah, I think this, I think this honor. Yeah, a lot of good this, bodybuilders coming out there. Japan, too. In Korea, they got some good bodybuilders coming out of there too. Hey, who saw the video of this one guy that I think he's from South Korea? Shredded, like yeah. clean shredded. That look. Yeah, they know he's a guy with like shoulder long hair. Mm -hmm. I think he's a classic yeah. physique guy. A double yeah. guy. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he's gonna he, he's in shape. His what? <laughs> Middles, what'd you say? Baki, B A K. -I. I think so. Yeah, man, that dude. That, that dude's look. He looks crazy. He's so peeled. Yeah. So yeah, peeled. And his skin, everything is just fucking perfect. Yeah. That's condition it's, it's, like back today, in the nineties. There's today on Instagram uh, comparison from two different shows, same physique, right? And then uh, showing what difference of light does. And then you look at it, condition is pretty much the same and looks night night and day. Mm. Good light mm. and bad light. It was the same mm -hmm. show. No, it's two different shows, yeah. Yeah. yeah he, he, That's he, why I like those guys, that they can get that crew together. He qualified for the Olympia, didn't that he? That lighting crew. That lighting crew from the Iron Man, man. They had, the, they had some, some of the best lights ever. I don't know what, what happened. The, light? the lights from the Iron Man back in the day, those lighting guys, uh -huh. they, they, they should have kept using that crew for the Olympia and everybody else. But they, they, the guys know how to do them light. What do you think of the Elvis Pro? Mm -hmm. Elves, mm -hmm. not Elvis. Chris, Elvis. here we go Elvis. again. Chris would call the show. Elvis Pro. One thing in my mind, but something else came out. EV, just say EVLS. EVLS. Yeah. So I, I said uh, yes. I won top three. Samsung got first, second, and third. 
you know, and then there was the, the rest of the people. You guys, oh, yeah, this guy could beat him. There was, Samson was so dominant there that if anybody knows anything about bodybuilding and said differently, oh, he could have lose. Why you say us? Nobody, nobody. You, you guys said it. No, you listen, guys, don't, don't say, say Milos, don't, don't, don't say. say about here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me say something. Not. Guys, let me say something real quick. Milos, don't say you guys. I never said. All I said was that I think that uh, Rubiel should have got second. I yeah, never yeah. said he should he should have beat the Samson at that show. I never said that. Yeah. There, there is a Which story online when, when De uh, Dexter said it. Dexter said it. Yeah, yeah Dexter exactly. said he should have I, won. I I thought he could have beat Crezo, and I thought he won a couple of shots in that in the on, in the overall. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, he was battling. He was battling, but it, 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 Samson is still ahead. I mean, come on. Yeah. Okay, Chris, 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 okay. How did he beat Krizo? Pose by pose, the body part by body part, overall impact. Because I was sitting there, and when he, when Krizo hit the most muscular, I thought he looked better than Rubio did. But when he was hitting the side shots, and he didn't win in all the back shots, the side shots, and all that stuff. And Krizo has front double, but he got that, it's, it's just torso. And yeah, I know exactly what you mean. What and Milos knows it too. Them, like, I thought, I thought that Rubio, and I'm just going off of pictures and videos. So Chris was there, I wasn't there. So yeah, I know it, it looks a little there, different. And I would have I put him ahead of Chris though, yeah. yeah. But you know, he just turned pro. I mean, <laughs> you know, how yeah. far can you really go? That, I don't know, that just shouldn't matter. And it is in the back of your mind that these guys just play in the world right. right now. Right, right, right. So, I mean, Samson uh, was a clear winner, no no doubt. Milos, no, don't don't, don't yeah. get this wrong. I'm just saying that this guy, if he puts it together, and what he's going to be yeah. a real threat to Samson because he can take his hype of being the biggest guy, yeah. have body parts that are outstanding. I'm not saying he beat him now. Yeah, Rubio has a thin skin yeah. and ability, ability to be really muscular and shit is happening and all that stuff. My comments, and you can see this all over the internet and, and, and uh, what do you call it, uh, Instagram. There was many moments when you can, I can send you the videos. No, I don't know. It looked what like saying. a door, like a straight up and down, standing in a, in a line. You were just standing there, though. But let, let me so, ask you. So, so, so hold on. Oh, okay, just, 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 let me uh, you know, make the point. That's why I want to ask uh, uh, Steve Weinberger. Are you guys actually looking when they're just standing there, okay? You have to assess physique. That's his normal. Now, some people can suck it up into the vacuum and pull out, and then they have a V taper and everything created by that vacuum. But reality of this is what is in front of you, standing there is just straight up and down. Okay, so is that part being judged and assessed? Oh, no, 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 we're not seeing this. Okay, relax, do whatever. Look like a fridge, doesn't matter. But then now when you hit the pose, now we're just judging no, the No, no, but we already know. It's been established okay, but, that the judges do look at the lineup. So if yeah. you stand, they, they, we already know that, that they do look at guys in the lineup if they make a comparison. So they, if you stand there looking like a door, you'll probably have less chances of getting a good a call out as if you stand in the lineup, you know, make, okay. it, make, make a note. Well, I mean, let people see. Let me say this. Let me yeah. say this. So even when it comes to posing, the relax is really not on the relaxed pose. So that is something that's missing in bodybuilding. Even on the side, how do you keep the eyes on you? How do you attract the eyes back onto your physique? That stuff has to be taught. Most of these guys don't know it. So tell me, how, how do you keep your eyes on you when they're having a comparison in the front? Little, 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 things, little things you can do. For instance, <laughs> when the guys are judging, right, they're looking down the line and back on both sides. Yeah. In that but moment, you're talking, you're but Melvin, there, you're little, talking, little, but Melvin, you're talking in between comparisons that's what he's talking about in between he's mm -hmm. saying on the side when they're, standing on the the side, side, when they're, when they're off to the side he said are oh, this is that being judged when they're just standing there well even how do you keep the attention on you if you stand like a door dormant with no movement the eyes are never attracted back to you so there's there's th certain things you can do to get that attraction you can shake a leg and pull the distractions out you can move your abs and flex them you do certain things to draw attention back to you to get back into the fight yeah. samson don't do it god dang uh 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 Lunsford don't do it. How do they all stand like doors? So how do you get past them? It's, it's a posing battle. Uh, so it's not about, you know. Samson relaxed, was looking, and that's what I point out to Dennis. Look at it, look at it. They, they were off the, to the side. And I asked him, who is the best body? That was so obvious. You yeah. know. Was it, so, well, how does he, how okay, does he, how does he demand that? 
You see, you, you, you are my guy, you know, you know, before, what did I tell you? Back in our times, there was just top three being uh, compared. I mean, three at a time. Mm -hmm. But Steve Weinberger, like you said, would look at this. He already knows what's happening. He glanced who is the next comparison. Mm -hmm. So you have to attract mm -hmm. the attention. So attention. Gustavo, anybody, you have to. Abs tight, legs separated, shoulders up. Don't drop it. Don't don't breathe. You know. Mm -hmm. uh, well, little things you can do. But uh, okay, you this, this, uh, you you are working with uh, Rubio. Look at on Instagram, and you're gonna catch it. This cannot happen, because if I would be Steve Weinberg and I see him, oh my God, waist is as wide as shoulders, and this is how he's standing right there. Right away, he's starting from the bottom for me, before they even hit the pose. I already judge him. Okay, this is not to be tapered. This is not the shape I'm looking for. Crazy but, mass. But a okay. lot of people, you can, you can point that out. A lot of people, they're just standing there, Milos. That's why I want to talk to Steve Weinberger. You can point that out on, you can point that on, on Dorian. You can point that out on uh, Jay Carlin. Mark Jay, all of them. You can point a lot, but, and they beat a lot of people, good people with shape. Yeah, but I, I think he's making the point, like, if you're already in the first call-out, then you're going to get back in line. You don't have to stand there like this no more. You were already in the first call-out. He's right, it's, right. It's talking about the next guys. That's getting called out. You want to make, you know, you want to let people see you. You got to, you got something's yeah. got to, it's got to attract um, yeah. my eyes towards you. And and I get that. I right. get that completely. Right. And Milos, right. Milos right. was right. preaching this from day one. So how yeah. you stand in the back is very important. Years. But but yeah. practically, right? Be Steve Weinberger, okay? So he has to choose first call out, but uh, now he has to choose second. How is he determining that second? Well, he's watching the first one. He still glanced. Well, okay, you know, this is how you get it. Well, determination. They already mm -hmm. made up their minds. They already have numbers on the on the sheet because they do the, the mandatories first. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna come out. They come out in groups. They're gonna do front double biceps, quarter turn, back double biceps. So they already know what you look like, and then you do mm -hmm. your mandatories. They already know if you stand in the back like you know, because he he was there like you said, standing like a door, and he still got first call out. Mm -hmm. So they obviously they saw thing. something prior to that that was enough for them to know hey, we got to bring him out. You know what right. I'm saying? But still, for the other guys that are not first call out guys, if you don't want to be in the last call out, you want to make sure you stand there like a statue, you know, so they can see that you're always there. You know, if you start hanging low mm -hmm. and leaning forward, bending over <laughs> and all that shit, you yeah. know, you don't want to do that. Melvin, if you're going to do it. Um, yeah. Melvin put to, six months ago uh, on his Instagram mandatory is how he did it. Mm -hmm. And that was a wonderful video, right? And if this is what you're doing right now and everybody is uh, watching, Chris is master poser, Melvin is master poser. Take a couple of hours of your time, drive, see them and, and work on the posing. One, two hour session is going to probably be enough for your career. Mm. You know, the, the, if, if, if they apply. If they apply it, it makes a difference. I didn't learn that overnight. I didn't learn how to pose like that, stand like that overnight. Many a times I stood for with a freaking stopwatch in front of Chris, and he's clicking it 15 seconds, clicking 20 seconds. And after a while, you build up an endurance. But I started way back when I was a beginner. I never got the – had a choice or not to learn. You know, I yeah, had but, people on my yeah, back. But, I had eyes on me all but the time. Melvin, you know, I had Chris. I had Milos. I had John Brown. But the art of posing – You had Sean Ray. But Melvin, but Melvin, let's keep it real. But Melvin, let's keep it real. Melvin, let's keep it real. You can teach someone the mandatory poses. You can teach someone transitions in between poses in their routine. But can somebody turn your phone sideways? Okay. But can somebody? Can you teach somebody to pose like you? I can. I can. I can. I can I, did I you can say you can or you can't? I, it depends on which part we're speaking. No, of. no, okay, no, no, so no, no. See, I, that, that's why. I, that's why I, I, I went in there with the right way. I said you can teach someone how to do the poses correct. You can teach mm -hmm. someone to transition, but can you mm -hmm. teach someone to pose like Melvin Anthony? No fucking so. way. No way. No chance. No. Unless, no. unless it's no. a guy with the same um, talent as you. Yeah, a guy. I can take a guy I that has a dance. 
I like people to have their own their own style. Yeah. And just I mean, if I can help but them. There is no, but there is, there, there is but no when I mean style, talent, I when I mean talent, like Melvin, Melvin's got a talent. You can put any any guy, doesn't matter if it's Lee LeBron or anybody, and show them routine and tell Melvin, listen, copy that routine. I guarantee I you Melvin would copy that routine to the T. In, yeah. in seconds. I can do and it that's in seconds. Something, and that's a talent you got to have. That's a talent you got to have. You don't, you don't, have you have you don't learn that. Catter. Hey. Huh? What did Mad, you say, Melvin was, Melvin was a kid. You're a copycatter. Oh. So, okay, that's the case. Everybody, everybody in bodybuilding is a copycatter because you copied from Ed Corny and Arnold Schwarzenegger yeah. and Serge Debray and Robbie Robinson. True. And, and oh. should I go on? So everybody on this, everybody on this panel. Robbie Robinson. Me, yes, you did. Melvin, Stop get him back. Melvin, Robinson. get him no, back. I said I tried to. Melvin, I, give it, get him back. Get him back. Tell him he copied the pose from Linda <laughs> Murray. He copied, he, copied, he copied from everybody. <laughs> Kristen copied from everybody, just like we copied yeah, from him. Yes, I copied from the girls. You. Yeah, I, I, I took me too. Uh, Linda, you took, you took Linda, Linda, Linda comes Linda to Murray. Murray. You took Linda Murray. I had, uh, no, no, I had Corey Everson did that last spread with the with the feet. Oh, open. so like, Corey was the first one. So Corey, was I'm gonna shit too. And then uh, what? Anya Langer. Now you got now, now Anya you got Langer to was another one I used to get some stuff from. Anya Langer, uh, uh, Carla Dunlap. I'm, I'm getting all. Did I yeah, you did I tell you guys? Did I tell you guys that I ran into Anya? Well, I ran into Anya Langer. Anya At the fucking listen, I'm sitting after the uh, after pre judging Friday at the Olympia. Me, Robin Chang, and Barbara from from Italy, we going to be looking for some food. Everything was closed because it took so long, so we went to Dennis right next to the hotel. We sit there. All of a sudden, this guy comes up. Uh, are you Dennis James? And and I had a girl with him, and I'm and I'm like really looking. He said, "Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm. she recognized me," and I'm like, mm -hmm. I was a fan of her since she even started, and I remember seeing pictures of her, and I'm like, because she was awesome looking, pretty, she had she everything. Was. There she was, was Anya Langer right there at Dennis, coming up to me. That's crazy, Chris. You, you don't remember the next day I told her to come to the booth to to to, to join the podcast. She did come to Saturday. She did come before we started. She did come to the booth, but she said, Olympia? "Yes." She did come oh to the booth, God. but she said, "Listen, I'm not, I'm not prepared. I, I you know, I, she was oh, a little yeah, bit too shy." You did say that. You did say that. I didn't yeah. know you were talking about her. She, but she I did show up, and she said, "Listen, I can't do it, but I, I just wanted, you know." I said, "I want to bring her on, so in the future, I'm hopefully, you yeah, know, when she gets on. ready." Dude, yeah, Anya, she should be she cool. I met her son and goes. Hold on, you can yeah. take yeah. a picture. No, I'm no Milos. I say I'm not like you. I'm, I, I don't just take pictures with everybody. I don't know why. It's just. Yeah, pictures go up my I know. I mean, oh, listen, Milos, if I had someone with me who takes pictures you know, constantly, I would probably have easy, more pictures, uh, too. <laughs> I, I hope I'll take a picture with uh, President Trump two, two weeks from now. Yeah, if he's coming. Yeah. If he's coming. Yeah. yeah. Take, take one for me, too. <laughs> listen, I'm your arm around him. Sure. Listen, but she still looks good, though. I mean, she still looks good, and, you know, and I, I, was just, I was just pleasantly surprised that she even recognized me because she was before me. Yeah. yeah. Way before, before I even started lifting weights. You know, so yeah. that was for and me. Her, it was like her leg positions, the thing that she was doing with one arm, right? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. I told her the story hey, that I ball. told her the story that I was working for a company where we developed film roles. You know, back then when you still had the thirty-five, the roles that you have to send yeah. off, get them developed, 36. and you send them back. And I remember I'm I'm at the machine where the, the, the you know the negatives come through, and, and I see the pictures, and I see Anya Langa's whole the whole shoot. From on your line, I was like, I'm looking at them pictures. <laughs> I didn't know what you wanted. Like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we know, I was, we I was know. drooling over her that time, man. Yeah, I yeah. kid you not. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got to bring her on. I got to bring her on. I told her, I said, listen, it's all relaxed, casual talk. She, you know, she thought she had to be prepared, so she was a little shy, you know. Yeah, I don't know why. She's a she's a legend. That one. Yeah. I met her with Fivo. She cool. She knows her bodybuilders too. Yeah, but listen, her body, uh, but uh, let's, let's, let's mention here where, where credit is due. Juliet Bergman, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, Juliet has that uh, physique, and, and then imagine she never she won. Did. Back in the day, she retired for seventeen years. Comes back and wins the Olympia. Yeah. What story is that? Man? I don't know why. That's crazy. I don't know why she with that other company, but whatever. She still <laughs> she's still with them. She still yeah. yeah, she could help me so much, Dennis. Oh, did I on tell the, you? Uh, did I? On, on, oh, on Juliet did? Is that? Juliet? 1993, how old were you? Me? No, Melvin, 93. 
93? How old was I? Shit. Mm. Oh, shit. 30, 30, 30, 31? I'm about to tell us one. Could have been 31. Uh, no, he was older. He was 19, older. 19, you said 1993? I was 23. I so. Or maybe five. Or maybe five. You know, well, why did you say 30? You remember. You, hey. you were with... Uh, hey. You were 23. what? 23. 23. Yeah. I was 24. You one year younger? You. In 1993. You one year younger than me? Oh, 93. You now? After all these years... Yeah, I'm they got lied on my, Let me tell you what I said. Melvin, Melvin lied about his age too for a long time. I, I, I lied about my age. So let me tell you when I when I got into bodybuilding. Yeah. Shut up. Finally. Oh, said, so now you know. Shut up. So he made himself younger, right? I turned, I, on November 13th, Melvin Anthony, the marvelous one, turned 54. So when I came in, you know, John told me back in the day, he said, hey, listen, if you were young, they'll they'll gauge how far you can go. Uh -huh. If you're too old, they'll cap how far you can go. Which one you want to do? I said, yeah, I want to go as long as I can. He said, so, so you're going you're gonna to dummy this damn way, so we're going to say you're 23. So yeah. I went further. When I signed up for NPC, I did use whiteout on my birth certificate and, and, and wrote it in. Sure, it did, 71. So it looked like I was 21. So you were 69? I was born 69. Okay. Yeah, so they never did are you 55? Anyway, there, there was a moment. 54. Dennis, you yeah. ask uh, Melvin if he can teach somebody else to pose like him, and, uh, and we all know we can. So I go to John Brown's house, and there was Melvin there, young Melvin, right? And I gave him my camcorder, and he was videotaping me and, and, and John. And I was. John was doing the <laughs> John Ray, you know, the, the Vince Taylor, the spinning, all this shit. And I tried like ten times, and I looked like a, like like a dumb, dumb fuck, right? He was he was having trouble. And, and uh, like Madden, Madden was uh, taping, right? I, it just it wasn't me. So then he goes, okay, okay, Melvin, you come. So now I'm taping Melvin, and Melvin did like perfect. Just from watching like, you doing exactly. it wrong. Exactly. No. Yeah. Just yeah. watching. Yeah. And, and that was the moment that I realized, you know what? I can't do this shit. That's his know? talent. I, I, That's his talent. He has a talent. Yeah, he, he could. He could have did it. It's just basically when well. I come on, you saw me, man. Don't be nice. Yeah, <laughs> I yeah, had the two left. Okay. I'm a, yeah, yeah. Milos was Milos was walking like a dog. He, he said, he, "Don't he, be I nice." I was trying to help because he was getting mad. <laughs> Milos was getting so frustrated, <laughs> and I, I looked up to Milos so much. It's like, man, that's the that's the that's the guy. That's that guy. He said, "Hey, Melvin, you try it." I was like, "You sure?" I didn't want to make him look bad. I said, "He's a pro." That's that's that guy. I got his autograph in my car. He said, he said "Just do it. Go ahead." And when I did it, Milos' face was like. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, this, like, this little kid is doing it perfect like like this Every, everything john did he copied like with a finger and everything yeah. you know facial expression that. angles facial expressions hands. animation mm -hmm. <laughs> he taught me but when i was a kid at nine years old in a break dance crew and dennis people don't know dennis was popping and locking too dennis can dance his ass off too but he yeah. just won't I said, me and Venus had battled many times in the kitchen. Me and him go back and forth in front of, in front of Banana. So I said, get him, Daddy. We went at it right there in Thailand. Go at it. Me and, I didn't know this. Get out like that. Why you don't do that on stage? He's like, no, bro, that's all you. <laughs> but at nine I years used old, to do it on stage. Dance. I used to do it on stage when I was competing as an amateur in, in, in the, with Naba. I was doing break dance. Sure I didn't know how to pose, so I had to fucking break dance. They said, he can do it. They said, Dennis can get down there all the way. Yeah. So yeah. back then, I, I had nine find... years old, I had to learn. Uh -huh. No, 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 the moment actually. Chris and I, we are up here and you guys are down. Chris and I were on the stage on Iron Man 99, first and second, right? And then at the end, if you if you roll the tape, they, they showed the audience that it was uh, Dennis and... Uh, and uh, we were Malvin. sitting right next to each other, yeah. It. And then you did the posing. We <laughs> right peeled that shirt off right away. Let Chris know uh, right I'm coming. Away. I have to find it. I have to find it. <laughs> I'll let Chris know I'm coming. I don't know what happened. I know did Chris started. Chris said some shit. Chris, no. Chris did it. Chris that was did no, it. but the, no, that, no. Chris said it the year later, two thousand one. Yeah, I think I will never okay. forget that shit. I'll, I was like, you mother. He went yeah. off stage. Chris <laughs> did his. Man? Chris did his mandatories. Chris, I don't know. If, you probably forgot. You didn't say nothing. You just did your oh. mandatories. Then you walked off stage. And walking off stage, you pointed at me like. His point, yeah, point at me. You don't remember <laughs> that. <laughs> Chris, please tell me you remember that. He did it too. He did it. <laughs> after that, Dennis. After that, Dennis had it. And then says, funny thing is, after that, Dennis had an alpha. Like, check that shit out. So, <laughs> he said, you know what? 
Hey, because yeah, me, hey, me and Dennis just talk every day. Yeah, yeah, me and Dennis just talk every day. Me and Dennis just talk every day. He would call for Thailand. And he said, man, I'm going to get that motherfucker. I mean, we're talking about that man. And that Chris pointed at me. I said, Chris pointed at me. He think I'm scared of him. That I got to say this. Ah! I, I got to say this. I got to say this. Chris, I, he made me train even harder. <laughs> and you need and this. You this it. is healthy competition, though. This is not, this is, there's no hate. Yeah, yeah, there's no hate. It. This yeah, is please. healthy. This is healthy. Because at the it's end tough. of the day, but the year before, the 99, when Milos was on stage, getting the second. You got second, didn't you? A second to Chris. Yeah. yeah. I remember. Uh, and it's Jay Cutler. Let, let me point this out. Jay was. You know why I remember? Yeah, you know why I remember? Because I just had turned pro in '98, and Melvin yeah. was getting ready for the '99 USA's. So yeah. I came over. I don't even know why I was here. I don't. Anyways, we went to the show, and then uh, whoever was announced was it Lonnie Teeper? Who? who Lonnie Teeper. Lonnie uh, Teeper. He called us oh. out. Oh, we got you, Mr. USA, with Melvin, blah, blah, blah. And then, of course, well, I would took the shirt off. I said, fuck it. You know? They went crazy. Well. They went crazy. Yeah. We were awesome. both like two But the thing with Chris, that crazy. was the following year. That was, no, that was. 2001, he came, he came out. 2001, yeah. 2001, 2001. Right? Before I, the honor. I'll tell you. Did you do I'll the, and I'll tell you. Did you do the, did you, forward, did you, you I did. competed. I was second 2001 against Chris. And I was no, going no, 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 no. 2001. At the Ironman? At the I Ironman, did, 2001. Did four, oh. I did four in a row. Yeah. They did them all and didn't get them every year. And so I remember we were on a plane and, and Dennis was every day. He said, one day I'm going to get him. I mean, you think I can get him? I said, man, Dennis, you got just as much muscle as Chris. <coughs> you got the same. You can get him. I said, but you know, that's the homie. I, I said, thought, but it ain't going to be easy. I thought I, I had him at the Arnold. I thought I had him at the Arnold. That was like literally a week later. I thought I had him. You know, but 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 Jim Jim protected him and and did the first call out with only two guys. That kind of fucked it for me. But anyways, I got him a week later in in, in Hungary. And hungry. And And I remember Melvin. Melvin Melvin was the one kidding. You got him today. You got him today. Yeah, yeah. So Chris in the front. Listen, I don't know how you got the front, right? Huh? Chris way in the front, right? Chris kept coming back there and he eat and he say, "Hey, how guys? How you doing?" He kept walking by with food. And every time he walked by, Dennis was looking at him like this. Louis Vuitton bag. Yeah, Louis Vuitton bag. Did this look at it? Did this? Did this? Was just not saying anything. So I was up there, we were shooting the crap with Chris, and for some reason, I seen Chris pick up some ice cream. I seen him. He, I said, he ain't gonna do it. Where? Chris, I know Chris. He's very strict. Where? Chris ain't gonna cheat. I seen him put that in his mouth. Bing. I said, oh shit. I ran. He ran put it in his. He, he ate ice cream backstage. No, on the plane. On the plane. On the plane. So I, I, I was go back and say, I, I was like, yeah, he would, he would relax. He would eat, eat ice cream. I was going to Hungary. So he, Milos, he, no, yeah, we, 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 I was, we weren't cream. even on the same uh-huh. plane going to Hungary. We, no. we weren't on the same flight. We, we were going out there. We were, we were not. We were, I told Dennis, I said, he ate ice cream. Trust me, you're going to get him this time. He was pumping up. I was looking at him. I said, Dennis, you're going to get him. You Dennis can... did not. Dennis was so focused. He didn't care what I was saying. I said, Dennis, you hear what I say? He looked at me and said, what? I was, I said, I was I like said, days ago going to that show. I, I, sure. I, he was relaxing. I said, Dennis, you're going to get Chris today. He said, you think so? I said, I just went and looked at him pumping up. You're going to get yeah, his ass I don't today. remember all that. Don't... I don't remember all that. I remember backstage. After we did yeah. the pre, the, the, the we did the comparisons. That's when I remember you telling me. So, you, I think you got him today. You got him today. <laughs> you you get his, you get his ass today. <laughs> I, I, I remember think, asking I one. Do. I just remember asking one question. I said, do you think they're going to give it to me? I said, I said they're gonna give it to you. I said, yeah. trust me, you just go in there and finish them off. And and He's you know, this was still do. this was still under Wayne. And yes. now, and I don't know if I told Chris, but you you remember the promoter back then, the guy with the with the with the fro. He the had like a fro. fro. I can't remember his name, but the promoter. He told me that Dexter was in second place. Chris would have got third. Mm-hmm. And Wayne Amelia, this is I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it real. I would have, I would have, I would have, I would have came off that stage. Hold on, <laughs> Chris, Chris, and the, the promoter told me after that Wayne Amelia said no and changed the score sheets. Where those photos at? Where those photos at? That's mm-hmm. how they don't matter. Your photos good. I just tell you, I said, but those photos. Photos. Chris, no, Chris, Chris, you were, so you, you know how they wait. Chris, Chris you, you were pretty, off. you were off. Are. Chris, you were really off. You were really, it wasn't even yeah. close. Do you know? Do you know that you know how it is with football games? In football games, when you when they start to lose, they Let's lose put their those momentum. Photos up. Let's take a look. Listen, we can, but you know the fans they lose their luster, they lose their drive. So I told Dennis after the show, I said, "Don't say shit to Chris." I said, "You can get him again." He said, "No, man." I said, "He got to know." I said, "Dennis, don't say shit." 
Yes. So we go in the uh, elevator. Uh, uh, we, uh, hey, look, listen, wait, 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 listen. Wait, let me finish. No, no, let no. me finish. Wait, let me finish. Hey, go ahead. Go so ahead. I, I, said, I told I look at Didis. I said, Didis, don't say shit. When he come in here, because I know Chris Pitts. I said, but you don't say nothing. So he comes in there, he get in there, and we're talking, and we'll be bullshitting. And Chris looked at, looked at Dennis and on the elevator. Look at Dennis. He said, yeah, you got me that time. Dennis looked at him. And I said, please. And my mother, I'm like, please, don't say that smart. <coughs> right back at him. and said, mm-hmm, I'll get you again. I never <laughs> said, said that. That's, yeah, Chris, they, do you remember that? It, you know yeah, Melvin become like you know Melvin Melvin's no, story no, go he's gonna just, go just, with, no 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 when Melvin gets said, to, no, no, Chris no, 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 Chris no, Chris no, no, we were no, both no, in no, supposedly we were both in the elevator Chris do you remember me saying that to you in the elevator and Chris said no, because you know I would give hundred percent if I did <laughs> it was already mad I said and I said Dennis what yeah you Melvin no Melvin you going you going you going you going too far now you going too far it didn't I didn't say that I didn't say that I'm gonna get you again I would never say that yes you did I'm gonna get you again but listen but listen listen all I know is once that happened it had clicked I said and then when I went on the bus and he was like I got him I got him I was like. I said, I got him. I was like, get his ass again. I, know, get his ass again. I had to call, to the right. I had to call <laughs> Milos. I had to call Milos and let him know. Listen, yeah, yeah. I, I was, <laughs> listen. I as soon as you got on the bus, you was on the phone. I was like, oh, shit. I was like, this flew on the the Chris. He, he picked the first seat to the right. Chris, the first seat Chris, you, even you gotta in. understand one thing. That was my first pro win. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, you beat this. I mean, uh, this is Smith. Yeah, beating Chris is a big deal. It's a big deal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's a huge yeah. deal. Yeah, so, See, so we started with this that uh, Melvin said uh, in San Francisco, I waited for this all, all my life. Right? I tell you why, because yeah, I didn't, because I tell yeah, you why yeah. at that time, at that time, and it's not, it's not like this no more, but at that time, and you know it, Chris, there was the oh, there was the there was the guys and then there was us the the, was the, the guys, guys coming up also competing to yeah. beat yeah to beat some of the guys that are established <laughs> is almost impossible yeah. even if you're better mm -hmm. you know you that Chris and, and Chris that's why you didn't take that show serious enough because you figured I'm Chris Comier I'm coming uh -huh. off the Arnold I'm coming <laughs> off the Arnold cream. and I'm gonna win this thing hell yeah. You know, yeah. Those days, so that's why I'm saying. Favorite. That's why I'm hey, saying, Chris. It wasn't even close. Not in hung, in Hungary. Check this out. And when and then that in that week in, in, <laughs> I got in my week in Australia, <laughs> I was like, okay. Yeah, you did what you had to do. Yeah, you now, so now I, I'm gonna go twice a day in the gym, yeah. twice a day on the cardio. All right, we talk about this a hundred times. We already know, Chris. Oh shit! <laughs> yeah, but some listeners, some listeners don't. They need to know. Yeah, yeah. Because they got to know how to respond when they yeah. get challenged. All right, what you happened in England? Said, okay, let me I tell can you beat this. this fools. <laughs> what happened in England? They can beat this. What happened in England? No, no, goodness, what goodness. excuse goodness. you have in England? In England? Yeah. England. I told you. Two thousand one. Oh, he, he, Melvin, you know, <laughs> let me, he thinks, you, you know, he's excused in England. He said that he asked, there. he said he asked me for some diuretics and I told him, yeah, all I right, did. I'm going to get him. And I let him sit there and didn't bring him diuretics. He, that's why he, yes. Chris, Chris, didn't go to sleep. <laughs> Chris, Chris, didn't go to sleep. Uh, you can take your eyes to sleep. scrambling around trying to find color and, and water pills the whole Chris, day. Chris, Chris, and finally go, go to sleep. You ain't gonna lay, lay Chris wouldn't down. travel nowhere without the stuff that he needs. Come on now. I was. I was, yeah, I was in a situation that morning, and I didn't know if I was even going or not. And oh. I, I don't know why I didn't have it already, oh. but I didn't have it. So then when I got there, I didn't have it. And then I was like, well, maybe I'll rely on my comrades that, you know, we were <laughs> brothers and iron. You said? We brothers and iron, so <laughs> you we know, you know, you know, each other's back. We, we trust each other to put our protein on each other's back, so I, no. I guess I just asked, uh, asked another brother, another brother, but oh, to no. this day, and, and, and I'll stand by what I said. Germany, so he didn't I get stand the, by what I said, Chris. The code, the Chris, code. I don't. I think you. I still to this day stand by what I said. You must have confused me I with stand someone what else. I said. You, but you. I believe you asked, <laughs> but I believe you asked a different person, and you thought it was me. No, no. If well, I, about, I would have told you right the there, I don't have lobby. any. I don't have any. Or if I tell you, I will go get it, and I will no, get you it. Said I don't have enough. To, you said I don't have enough to. What do you mean enough? Like you had enough. That doesn't even sound like what I would you. say. That doesn't I'm not going to give it to you, Chris. No, Chris. No, even if, if, if that would be the case, I would, to, to this, what, what, 22 years later, I would have told yeah, man, fuck you. You didn't want to beat me. Is that what you're saying? Huh? You did not want to beat me. And yeah, that, he did. And listen, that, yeah, he was, did. that was England. That was, was that after the Olympia? You did Olympia not want or? to beat me? 
Was, was that did, after? Did, like, yeah. I'm not the only one that beat you that day. Dexter beat you too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He, he but you were off, off. Says, Chris. You were off. Diuretic would not yeah. wouldn't wouldn't save you that day because you were really off. Yes, I didn't have. The, I, said, I just flew so in late. Remember? I, I know. But, but diuretics wouldn't have saved you, man. Diuretics wouldn't have because you you came I'm in with a face. <laughs> you came in like this. Your face <laughs> was look, the your face looked like your face so was looked like you were eating the whole flight. <laughs> How did I turn the tables in one week, Dennis? Huh? How did I turn the tables in one week? We went to Amsterdam. Oh, well, diuretics. <laughs> yeah. And if it wasn't for that, if it weren't for 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 Ronnie, I would have won the show. Remember, I took second to Ronnie. I still got the trophy over there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember. That was, uh, yeah, Amsterdam, I was there. Yeah. I, and I, I did it. I gave you two you mix because you had the seven fucking sandwiches it made. <laughs> <laughs> it, can't, it, can't, it, can't be no, it can't be no worse than uh, Flex going around down getting Whoppers before the Olympia. Hey, but, but uh, yeah, he's texting. Chris? Oh, I'm going to, oh. Whatever happens, whatever happens, sure, I heard sure. about it. Hey. Okay, here we go. It says Chris, y'all, y'all can look at it. It says Chris over here gets freaky. <laughs> this is the show. What? What show? You, you have a, you know, you have have a home. <laughs> I had this girl come on stage with me. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You was always doing something crazy. What a problem on y'all ass. <laughs> is that- oh, actually, yeah. I supposed to go to that party afterwards. But I end up in a hospital with Mustafa and Steve Weinberger. And remember, <laughs> next morning at five o'clock, we had to go to uh, to uh, England. Yeah, but that was a time when the the two strippers were were walking with every. Competitor. I wasn't even there at that time. I wasn't there. Yeah, you weren't there. That was that was two thousand three. Yeah. Mm. But Chris, ninety seven, Germany. They were calling top six. And I know that it was between me and you for that sixth place. And they call my and they call my name and I go on the fucking stage and I'm all happy, right? And say, oh no, 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 no. It's mistake. It's- <laughs> oh. <laughs> me here. Like, oh shit. That's so wrong. <laughs> hey Dennis, what's going on with it? What we're talking about that synthol use. You said you need something someone wants with synthol use. What, what, what is symptom, man? What is this, the oil people put in their arm. You know what the hell that is. I don't, I don't know. Nothing they, about. Yeah, hell yeah, yeah. People t- doing it too much. Melvin, do you have, do, are you dating a, a foreigner, a, a foreign girl at the moment? A foreign, a foreign girl? No. I, I know it's a personal question because I'm asking for a reason. I know you're asking for a reason. Yeah, that, 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 you, you're asking about the accent that keep coming out West Africa. Yeah, what's happening, man? <laughs> you gotta get around my boys. Get around my boys so long, and them suckers, suckers come out. <laughs> it's like in the bloodline. you got an accent the whole time. I was like, Minus, you don't hear that? No, it's in the bloodline. He's got that accent. Yeah. It's, it's, in the, it's in the bloodline. You want? Would you like me to speak like this? Would that be better? <laughs> would that be better? <laughs> yeah, that's for a butter. That's, that's another thing. Like that. That's another talent he's got. He can switch accents like yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. You know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He does it so well, and he sometimes can't get rid of it. <laughs> yeah, I can't rid of him. Yeah. It's an all fun. Hey, man, hey, I, I swear, I know, but you know what? Though? I remember when, when I one time I saw Dennis in the. Walking the goals. I know I said this a few times before, but I mean, if you, I, I swear, I swear, if you would have stayed on track on that, I think you would have had something way different in your career. Yeah, yeah. You know? I'll, I'll give. I, 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 I agree. You're looking, looking impressed. I was like, ah, oh, god damn. Did it? Did it? They scared. They scared me. Remember that time in the gym? Then they said he scared the whole gym. Hey, man, you gonna we that you tired of it? What dude? I said, let's do this. Who that? Who that dude? I ain't worried about that guy. His big shoulder, so what? Like a dummy. Let me go side myself up then. <laughs> I'm gonna go over there right now. And you better tell me the truth. Man, my crew, everybody, Chris, oh, you're gonna fight him. Mm-mm. That's a big nigga right there. That's a big. <laughs> How big you talking? He said, You want to fight him? <laughs> Knew I was in trouble right then. And it took me years to beat Dennis. God dang, it took me years. <laughs> eight years. One, two, three. It took me a long time to be able to get him. Took my end, end mm-hmm. of my career. End of my career as an old man. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. But you know, I'll listen, take, but listen, three, but let's I'll let's talk three, about I'll take three legs. But hold on. Instead of four. Let's talk about Melvin real quick. Melvin, you were your worst enemy. Okay? Uh, yeah. uh, you, you're right. If you and I said this a hundred thousand times, if I would have had your uh-huh. physique, I would win every show. But you mm-hmm. it was not the, your body wasn't an issue. <laughs> it was your mind when it comes to yeah, dieting. My mind. Because I found out stuff that you do 
while you get ready for shows that you never you never ever confessed. Fucking I waking up you. waking up in the middle of the fucking night, going to the gas station, <laughs> going to the donuts, gas Dookie Donuts, huh? Get, <laughs> no, eat, donuts even getting yeah. cake and ice cream. Cake and oh, ice cream. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That is, that is my demon. So I think I if you would have listen, if you would have if you would have been more strict with your diet, because the training wasn't the problem, the diet. Uh, okay. I think you could have been you could have been in a, a top five guy your whole your whole pro career. Yeah. That's my honest yeah, opinion. Yeah, I, I agree. Uh, I, I agree tried, with your honest I assessment. That food. I, I try to help him. I have in my house. This kind of the trash to get the cake out of the trash <laughs> anywhere. <laughs> Out the yeah, trash, dog. Some, some people have crack. Gotta, I got sugar. You really got to be fiending to go in the trash can and get some cake. <laughs> I, I guess, I guess you, I guess you understand there, don't you? you? You understand what crack do to people, right? Sugar does it to me. <laughs> you, some people have a refeed. I, I got, I got all out. <laughs> it's got a whole refeed week. It's a refeed, hey. refeed couple of days. I said, but yeah, a lot of people think I don't train hard. I remember after I one, after, I remember after one Olympia, we came back to Arizona. Me, me and Melvin, we at my house. <laughs> For like a week, we both gained about fifty pounds in that week. Melvin, <laughs> Melvin, Melvin went home that night. Yeah. He drove back home. Finally, I got rid of his ass. He went back to California, called nine one one on himself. <laughs> yeah, tough. Talking about my sales wasn't getting hydrated. <laughs> I, was, I went straight to nine one one. They put me on the goddamn uh, ambulance journey, and they asked me for an autograph. I'm yeah. about to die. He wants to go, go. Can you please sign this, sign this picture for me? Full went to his car, got a picture out at the hospital. You know, like, a, lot of, a lot of EMTs know who bodybuilders are. Yeah. Heck, yeah, they know. Mm. They know. I'm like, man, you're supposed to be I taking care I, of me. In Palm Springs, too. Yeah. Awesome. Well, hey, listen, speaking of yeah. that cheating, uh, Melvin's pro debut. I said that story before, but I have to say it again because it's good. <laughs> I, I go to uh, uh, New York with him, and I stay with him in a room. But we had an apple pie in a in a little fridge. It's okay, you know. That's the next day. Is that the and one he won? The is that the I one he won? Take it with you. Is that, is that, the, is that the no, New York? I won not a champion. It's two thousand. No, 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 oh. yeah, no, no, it, it was, was two thousand and one. Debut. Yeah. yeah, he beat Dexter. Debut. That's what, but anyway, I took a GHB and fell asleep. Of course. <laughs> next morning, you know, there is no apple pie. I say, hey man, what's up? Oh no, Chris took it. Chris took it. Okay. <laughs> I get to Chris. Hey man, how was apple pie? So what are you talking about? <laughs> oh, he lied right, right in your face. Yeah. Milos, I didn't realize you was helping Melvin. Were you helping Melvin and and uh, Dennis at the same time? I don't know. Uh, if it was yeah, in a, 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 a short uh -huh. period. Yeah, for a period. Yes. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I saw in a video uh, when we were backstage uh, at the Ironman. I didn't realize even until this last year. That you uh, you was helping him like that, and I was like, "Yeah, Milos did." Damn, yeah, this fucking Milos pumping up Melvin right there. I was mm -hmm. like, "Damn, I never realized that." Yeah, yeah. Milos helped me. Yeah, well, he come was, on, I trained, was, I trained in the gym. Training in my gym. No, I, didn't, I didn't put two and two together. I was one of the and, and Iris Iris Kyle crazy, but you have me doing walking lunges upstairs. That's crazy lady. That's the homie. But that sucker is a robot. I'm like, why I gotta do that? Just do it. You want groups? You gotta do that. So I had them watching me in the morning. I said, but when Milos went to sleep. <laughs> Hey, I heard that. I heard that deep. That's all I need. I went right to that fridge. <laughs> Melvin, what was what was the best sh the best shape you ever had? What year? My best can my best condition or best shape? Condition, shape? condition. Your shape was always great. Best, Melvin. Two thousand six. What? My best my my best condition. Yeah. Two thousand and ten. Then yeah. Because that's what that's when he was in my house and he couldn't fucking do that shit. I couldn't go nowhere. <laughs> that, and that boy did that. That boy did it. Let me tell you something. Yes. Let's yes. Tell you something. Video cameras in the Dennis' house everywhere. Oh, but the no, thing is, the is. thing is, Dennis, I saw him Dennis changing. He had striated glutes. No way. I swear yeah, to God, he had striation. Well, not dug out, but he had stro completely striated uh -huh. glutes. He yep. won the Phoenix Pro, and then he went off. Killed him. Then he went off by himself to go to the Arnold, and at the Arnold, he came in looking like I don't know what happened again. <laughs> He always go up by himself and yeah. do something like that. Yeah, but that yeah, was when he modest. couldn't wait. There was no that, no going to the Saggy Melvin in the There was no going like to no gas station at night. There now, was Dennis, did it, you go over Dennis, you go train with Dennis. Like I say, this so you come training with me. <coughs> I get breaks. Dennis, you see, you see that nice demeanor, that nice how he is. No man, Dennis is a goddamn correctional officer. That's you go to his house. You go to his house. 
You go to his house, Dennis ain't got nothing bad, period, in his in his house. Nothing bad. Nothing. Then he's he's very he sleep light like a baby. You get up, go take a piss, Dennis up, oh, fuck. I couldn't go, I couldn't get to his refrigerator, there wasn't nothing in there. Could get, could get there. And then we go to the gym, he train you. You get home, make your pose. You get up in the morning, make sure you're doing cardio. And I didn't see my body change. I was just so worried about getting caught, you know. Going to the gym one day, we did arms. I think boy made me cry on arms. I said, I don't think I want to do this no more. Uh, and tears. Yeah. Said, do 100, 100 reps. Yeah. Chris, Chris I had him crying. It's like, I, said, I don't like you, man. He's like, I, 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 I can't do to... this. I can't oh. do this no more. He was, he was breaking. I can't do it. <laughs> I couldn't do it. I had a breaking point. Nigga, my cousin, Marcus Hayden, laughing at me. That's all you got, man. And you, you can get beat up after this. You better shut up. Hey, don't, don't tease me. You know what, though? You know what, though? To be honest, though, like, I don't know why. Um, I don't know from the upbringing. I don't know your upbringing. But man, you wanted to quit a few times, though. Why? Mm-hmm. I don't get it. I don't know. I never, I say, never it, was, it was a, a fight or flight. You already, you already, you already in the door. Your foot's in the door. You already got the no. physique. What is the? What does that come from? I don't know. I, it, met, it might have been my upbringing. That's how it I met him. Been, just, that's how I'm, That's how I met him. After the '98 yeah. USA, where I beat him. Not quit. From him. Do something else. A couple of months later, I I contact him, you know, and I was like, "What you doing?" I said, "I'm done." He wanted to quit. Same thing for the 99 years. Well, yeah, at that time, 99, it was like, you know, I had spent all my, you know, Dennis, you don't understand. You you almost put maybe a homeless guy. Mm-hmm. See, that's when I started learning mistakes. I put all my money, all my rent money, all the money for electric bill, car, everything, I put in that show. And when Dennis tied me and got that trophy. Why you keep talking about like, a tie? Uh, Why you keep uh, talking about a tie? Ain't nobody tied you. Was, Somebody beat you. you tie. Somebody had to win at the end of the day, but after the preacher, that tie well, they, me up. Well, there's no such thing as a tie then. There's it's no a win thing. or a loss. Me and you. Win me and, no. or a loss. No. There's no tie, and there's no, nobody it, fucking flips a coin. You can flip, they did flip, flip the coin that night. No, no they, they did not flip a coin. History, Listen, that me and I talked to John Lindsay afterwards. Oh, and yeah, they yeah, said, I don't the care USA. what John said. Huh? I've seen, seen the cards. At the USA, we had the same amount of At points. At the USA, you got tied, Dennis. For real. Yes, we had I, the same I, amount I of understa- points. I, I understand that there was it was a tie. Yeah, it was a tie, the... but at the end, somebody's going to win. And it's not yeah, by yeah. flipping the coin. It's by looking at who had more I first thought, place I votes. Thought, I thought, uh, I thought, uh. But here's the difference. Here's the difference. I never beat you that night, though. Oh, shut up, Chris. I, I, I had it. I had it. <laughs> I beat you that night. But guess what? They gave it to get. It was a. It was a great win. Listen so to me. Earned. Listen. So Dennis, listen Dennis to me, guys. Listen to me, guys. You bo- both Southern Californians. <laughs> <laughs> You guys no. just can't live with no. the fact you that, that? No. you guys you. you guys can't live with the fact that I you come from all the way over from Thailand. I'm all the way I'm from Thailand doing my very first USAs and beat them. West Side. Yeah, if that would have been USA, if that I, I, if that would have been anything politics with favoritism, why would oh, they, why didn't they give it to him? I mean, everybody knew who Melvin was. Did yeah, nobody know who? Hey, nobody knew who I was. So you're saying they the judges? Should be, he should have beat you though. So though. you think? Did you mean you don't get me to say that? At all. <laughs> all that you know what that laugh means? Is, Chris is, I don't care. I got the win. Chris is still Chris is still sour. I was hoping Dennis would die that day. I said, I hope Dennis. I said, I hope you don't. I hope you can't stand up straight. I was hoping you better give him nothing. I told him you better get no salt, nothing. I took all my stuff. You better give him nothing. Bones. I, said, I hope. I hope he can die right here. I said, like, come on, guys, just ten more minutes. And Dennis was dying. I said, he, I'm cramping. I said, I hope you. I hope you cramp to death, nigga. I hope you. Pr- <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> I hope you can't come back. I, I, I really, I, I, I still apologize <laughs> to the, to this day that I didn't die. <laughs> <laughs> And then I walked away with the overall yeah, you, title. You, you, hey, you he heard us with that one. Heart. We were hurt. He, he, hurt me. Was, he hurt my spirit. So when he I called me, too. yeah, <laughs> he called hurt. me. He called me and said, hey, hey, all happy and shit. You know, happy go lucky. You know, he just, hey, he called me, hey, hey, nigga, what you, hey, what you doing? And I was sitting there with a half a pound of ice cream. I could, I could tell you, uh, almond and praline. <laughs> what? What you doing? I'm watching TV. I'm watching TV. He said, ain't you getting ready? I said, getting ready for what? <laughs> They said, get ready for the USA. I said, for what? Nigga, I ain't doing that no more. I'm going to get my money. I said, what you talking about? I got to pay my rent. They said, what you talking about? You ain't going to do the USA. I said, and what did I do? I and no what did I do? I ain't going to money. You say, you, you going to do that show. You said, you promised me one thing. If I help you, you get ready for the show, you better win. I said, what you talking about? He said, if I bring you to Thailand, how about I bring you to Thailand and get you a guest for huh. and make money? Yeah. Like, I'm a hater. And I'll get you. Like, I'm no, a hater, no hater, Chris. Dennis, Dennis is the cause of me <laughs> doing what I did. 
I said, what are you talking about? He said, if you come and make the money, you get all your supplements, you get all your rent paid, you'll, you'll compete? I says, I'll do it and I'll win. He says, because if you don't, and I fly my ass from Thailand, then you have a problem. And he did that. I went out there and made like $2,500 or something I like that. I picked him up from the airport. Did, did, <laughs> I picked him up from, picked the, him from airport. the airport. I had, a, I had $110 in my Lying. Pocket. Stop lying. Because I'll tell I you exactly what. No, you didn't have. Well, how much, you, what much I have? Well, I, you, maybe you did have 120 but I, when you came off the fucking plane, you <laughs> right before you even said hi, you said, man, I got $20 yeah. on me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I had $20. I was like, God damn, I thought you broke, but I didn't know you were that broke. <laughs> no, no, I was broke because I had $120, but I lost 100 at the airport. Yeah. <laughs> so, so I had $20. <laughs> and when he pulled up $20, I said, I ain't got nothing to eat with. I said, this is all I got. I said, I hope it's cheap over here. He said, boy, he started laughing at me. Because yeah. I go in the intention to uh, not depending on nobody. I had $20. He said, don't worry about yeah. it. You good. That was, that's, called, that's, that's, called su- show do. that's called supporting your fellow bodybuilders. That part. He I even fucking me. flew all, all the way from, Calif- from California. From, from yeah, Thailand to California China, to watch the show. Guys. We all have to help each other. Yeah. Uh, yeah, everybody. Yeah. That's I what's help, missing. I, I help him. I help him. Yeah. Help, uh, I mean, Milo's helped me. A lot of guys. I mean, I was yeah. like. We help each other. Yeah. We help Milo's, each other. We help each other train, you know. I, I remember, kiddo, Chris don't like to sleep. Everybody only has helped each other. I mean. And now you guys got to help me and get off this damn Zoom call so I can end this damn podcast. No. We, we, we got a lot of talk about. I got a meeting. I got a meeting here in ten minutes, so I got to get out. Oh, okay, okay, man. Okay. All right. Okay. All right, okay. guys. Well, Listen, so Chris, you have a safe out, flight man. to China. Get back home, but, but may, hopefully this time you know where you're at, what city, and yeah. everything. Yeah, I'll be doing next week. Uh, he's gonna be in Chinese. Yeah, hotel. he's gonna have to. Yeah, he's gonna. gonna be, he's gonna have to. My cell phone, guys. He's gonna have to find yeah. the right time. Yeah. Yeah, China. You still waiting to take me to China? You need to call. You bring. Well, next time you got Samson down, you need to you need to call me up, you know. And they get in space. Uh, both uh, of your, Samson both of your clients. Comes, he doesn't come to Vegas, you know, shit. Why? He just, he goes straight to the, what are, he's going to be in Columbus, Ohio, so I'll probably meet him there. Mm. Mm. I wish yeah, he'd he been for like a week. I'd like to get my hands on him. He <laughs> listens. He's, he, he listens. You know, that's I like him because he listens. You tell him something, he does it. All right. Listen, All guys. Right, okay. Thank you, and Melvin. Thanks, man. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta bring you on more often because this is. Yeah, funny. I'll, 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 let you tra- I'll let you train down there in Palm Springs, Melvin. It's okay. I said I'm already out there. You just better, you just better make that call, boy. Uh, you better check in, bro. All right, Milos, oh, take care, man. Milos, what's, Milos, what's next for that, you? That, uh, in freeway. What's next for me? Uh, I'm going uh, uh, to Cabo San Lucas for for treatment. Oh, you're going now. It's on the ninth, right? I'm going on the uh, on, on Saturday, Friday. Oh, how long are you staying? Yeah, we'll just until Sunday. Yeah. I, I think it's one day. Did he tell did you? He did he tell you to stop the caffeine and uh, fish oil and everything? Nope. Oh uh, well, you don't get the real information then. Stop all fish okay, oil. Uh, stop all caffeine. Right. Everything now. What treatment are we talking about? The caffeine. St- uh, stem cells. Yeah. No I coffee have now. A thousand no. milligrams of caffeine right yeah, here. Yeah. 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 Stop it. Coffee. I don't know why he wouldn't tell you. you know? Yeah. You wouldn't tell me. You yeah. tell me what's going you probably, on. I hope you get the real deal. <laughs> I need to I need to get some real deal, put some muscle back on. So I can, so fish I can oil too. I have to stop fish oils. Yeah, everything. Yeah. I had to stop oh. fish oil. Yeah. I'm texting right Just now. until you're done with the with the treatment, and after that, you can start it again. Right. They they, hey, they give, told give me, me some, they told me to stop it two weeks prior. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. All right. Maybe he doesn't take it as serious as these guys over there in Colombia. I don't know. Sure. Send me the information, Dennis. I want to know about that. I don't have the information from the Milos has the information. It's a different person. Yeah, mm-hmm. you know, I, I'm doing with Dr. Khan. He did uh, uh, something with the Regan, with the C bum. You know, doing doing many other uh, athletes, yeah. and uh, mm-hmm. I'm looking forward to because uh, Dennis swears by it. Absolutely, you know, so. absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I'd like to try it, man. A hundred percent. Let me smack back. All right, guys. Listen, I gotta go. You guys, you guys, are killing my time here. Get out. All right. All right. Go. 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 All right. Peace out. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Peace out. West Side. <laughs>